Hello. <laughs> Happy Saturday, you guys. How's it going? <clears throat> oh my goodness. How is everybody doing? Rod Legion, thank you so much for the bits over on Twitch. I appreciate it. So many first time chatters. Hello, 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 hello. I would describe this game as anti Elden Ring. He would be right, Nathan. I needed a bit of a break. Okay, I needed a cozy, low key, comfy day. That's what I really needed today. Low volume? Is it? Pretty sure the volume is the same as that sounded like the House of the Dragons trailer. <laughs> that did, yeah, that did uh, play for a split second. I was making sure I had it loaded because I do want to react to that today. <laughs> I was like, crap, they're going to hear it. Volume is fine. Yeah, my volume is, is always been like this because I trust me, you're not going to think it's low when if I ever scream. I mean, maybe I won't scream because it's a chill day. It's a chill day today. Just saw your TSA story. Oh my God. Yeah. Yeah, y'all. I went to an event last night and it was for like the YouTube. It was for Smosh, which was so cool, but it was also for the YouTube Creator Collective. Um, we've got Batman in the chat. I know. <laughs> they detected it so fast. Um, and they were like, do their little confessional thing where um, you, you answer a few questions. And one of the questions was what was like either the weirdest fan encounter you've ever had or where you were like least expecting it. And I said the TSA agent at the airport. Not only that, not only was it, I didn't even mention this in the video. It wasn't only just like a TSA agent. It was the guy that like, you know, stamps your boarding pass and does all that. I did mention that, but it was in my hometown airport, which I thought was even kind of crazier. Like it wasn't LAX. It wasn't like New York. It wasn't some big fucking airport where you're like, okay, well, there's a lot of people here. It makes sense. The probability is higher. It was, it was my hometown. And I even said to him, I was like, did you know that I'm from here? He was like, no, I had no idea. <laughs> Crazy. That really blew my mind. Um, Maggie, thank you for the tier one. I really appreciate it. Um... Will Morgan, thank you for the 19 months. Hope the game is fun and chill. You deserve it. Lol. Thank you, Will. Thank you. I'm excited for a little bit of a break. TSA agents know everything. I do. I know. That was the thing. Like, it was kind of scary because I was like, oh, my God. I hope he likes the channel and isn't going to, like, <laughs> say, you can't get on the plane because your opinion on space balls is bullshit. Or something. <laughs> your opinion on this movie sucks. <laughs> No, he was really nice. He was just intimidating the way he said it. And I was like, <laughs> New Yorkers being a New Yorker. Yeah. <laughs> oh, thanks, Sarah. Oh, I appreciate it. I appreciate you being here. Do you know who I am? <laughs> it was more like, you know who I am? That's fucking weird. Never mind, it was my headphones. Yeah, I was about to say, I'm pretty loud, Zed. So <laughs> I don't know if you want me to turn it up. <laughs> I've been there before, though, where I'm like, man, I can't get this to go any louder. And then I'm like, oh, you switch the headphones and it's like, oh, it's so much better now. Um, So I thought we could start off. JT King, thank you so much for the 200 bits. We're playing a game I can keep up with, lol. <laughs> me too. <laughs> me too. Same. The last game I played, Elden Ring, I can't even keep up with it, okay? Like, it's hard. This is a lot more my speed. I grew up with like 2D pixel art kind of games, like the OG Pokemon games. That was like my jam. So I really like Stardew. Although the first time I played Stardew, I didn't really understand farming games. And like, one, I didn't really understand how much there is to do in the game. And so I was just really like confused. I didn't really know what was important to do or what wasn't. And I, I wasn't really into gaming that much yet. So I was just kind of like, mm, I don't know. Like the time goes by so fast. I don't like it. I didn't realize you can pause the time by like opening your menu. <clears throat> and so finally, like years later, I saw a video. It was, I forget 
the name of the creator. I can find her, but she made this creator made a video on doing the Joja Mart route, like where you marry Morris and you basically turn the town into like a Joja Mart, like a company town, and it's it's like the worst storyline you could pick essentially. And I was like, oh wait, this game is way different than I really realized. So, oh my God, what's going on? DJ Low. Thank you so much for the 10 gifted. You're insane. Thank you. Nathan, Dark Knight, Davey, Leonardo, Yanni, Lucas, Doming Dominguez. <clears throat> You've been here so much. I don't know why I was having a hard time saying your name. Sorry. Teahu, Sean, Brian the Broken, Game Crazed. Say thank you to DJ Low for your Golden Nugget membership. That is so nice. I am a famous YouTuber for I beat an Elden Ring boss and it only took me 70 times. <laughs> yeah, no. Guys, I'm um so at the event last night, I um met someone from offline TV, so that was kind of funny. Um we could talk about streaming a little bit and that was like interesting. I was like telling him how I tried Elden Ring and it was really hard. <laughs> I'm not good at it. I was a Harvest Moon kid. I think uh, my brother-in-law loved Harvest Moon too. Um, so, yeah, I know. I know. Uh, Stardew is based off of Elden Ring. Spoilers. Sorry, there's gonna be spoilers for Stardew because I've already played a lot of it. Actually, um, Dominguez comes from Spain. It's really hard to know. It's not that. It's not that hard. I just got tongue twisted for no reason. Dave the Diver is also pretty chill. Is that a game? Or a, a creator? Who's Dave the Diver? Stardew, let's go. I'm so excited. If you haven't played... Oh, it is a game. If you haven't played Dave the Diver, I will happily second it. As maybe the best successor to Stardew there is. I have not heard of this. Hmm. Finally made it to my first Golden Nugget stream. Welcome, the nerd guy. Lo. Welcome, thank you for joining. A new update added so much, it's practically a new game. Yeah, so I will admit, because I've actually been playing Stardew, it's a fishing sushi restaurant game. Oh, that actually does sound like fun. Thank you for the suggestion. I'm excited about that now. Um, can you play it on Switch? Just curious. Because uh, whenever I can play a game on Switch, I'm like, ooh. Although I've been playing, I do prefer playing Stardew on PC because it's just so much easier than the Switch. But when I'm traveling, it's nice to, you know, have the Switch. Uh, I forgot what I was saying. Oh, so I have been playing Stardew more recently. I, I like, I played a lot of it like at the end of last year, got up to the point where like you start exploring Ginger Island and did a little bit on Ginger Island. And then I kind of stopped. I didn't like beat the game or finish everything. I just kind of like quit at that point. I like lost interest. Then I kind of rediscovered it and I was like, I want to start a new farm. So I started a new farm probably like a couple weeks ago now. Um, Ginger Island, lol. Sorry, yeah, that's a that's a part of the that's a part of the game. You gotta get, you gotta play it. Um, sorry, there will be spoilers. I'm, I I can't help myself. Uh, but I figured today, depending on what y'all want to do, do you want to like start fresh? Because we could just start a fresh farm. I could also show you the farm that I currently have. It's currently on year two, summer. I'm not super advanced. Okay, it's not like super fancy. It's, it's pretty bare bones, but I can show you what I have if you want. Um, and then maybe we could create our own farm together. Um, it's up to you. You reacted to the Karate Kid? Nice. Yeah, it was, I loved the Karate Kid. It was so sweet. Show me what you got, but start fresh. Show it off. I d I'll show, I'll show off what I have, which it's not that impressive. I'm not even done with the community center yet, but I'm so close. You know what I did? You know what I forgot to do? That's kind of fucked me up with the community center is um, forgot to keep some pumpkins. I sold my pumpkins, so that fucked me up. And then didn't grow. The quality crops one has got me fucked up. I'm missing one melon. I'm almost done with it. And then um, I also forgot to watch the queen of sauce for like an entire year in the game. So I still don't know how to make a maki roll. So yeah, that one's got me held up. 
I vote for just keeping your run going. I'd love to see and then start a new one. Show off and then start new. Okay, well, sh it seems like most people, there's a new farm type with the update. Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. Okay, we're going to show off and then I'll show off my farm, which it's not much to show off, but I do really like, <laughs> I do really like uh, the way my character looks right now. I think it's funny. So I'll show that to you guys and then we can start anew. No community center completion in one year equals failure. Dude, I, my ADHD brain can't. I can't. It's impossible. I have, like, I even have its own chest for the community center where I keep things that are for the community center in the chest so that I don't get rid of them. And it's just so hard. Like, Stardew is, like, not good for people with I, I don't really know if i have adhd I, i'm actually getting evaluated for it next week guys um because i really think i have it and i've gotten like pre-evaluated and the pre-evaluation says that i likely have it but i'm i'm getting like professionally evaluated no not no, next week that's a lie early april i'm getting evaluated so we'll find out together um every time i've gotten evaluated they've essentially told me mm, you might have it but you also might just not <laughs> and I'm like, that's not helpful. <laughs> like every time I've been evaluated, they're like, mm, maybe. <laughs> I'm like, can you tell me poll for Natalie? <laughs> poll, a poll. <laughs> we'll let the poll decide. <laughs> oh, Batman, thank you for the gifted membership. I love your username. Big fan of your work. Thank you. <laughs> productivity will skyrocket if you get treatment well here's the thing because I don't I I definitely am a, on board for like some therapy <laughs> I'm like on board for it um you know some mental health help I think would be nice um some some psychiatry big fan I I don't know if I want to be medicated, really, to be honest. Like, I don't. That's like a last resort kind of thing for me. So I do think I need some tips, though. <laughs> I think I need some behavioral <laughs> therapy. PCIX, thank you for the 12 months. Hello from Atlantic City. We love you. All of Atlantic City? Are you speaking for Atlantic City as a whole? <laughs> Are you sure? Because I roast on Jersey a lot. I don't know if they love me. But I love you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for the membership. <clears throat> My wife was diagnosed and it just helped open doors to find ways to get past hurdles with executive dysfunction. Yeah, there are just some things that I'm like, I think that's a problem that I get. Like, I get super overwhelmed. <laughs> no Ankins message. That's funny. ADHD. Yes. No. Squirrel. <laughs> um, it, it It's like. I'm like, I'm already getting distracted. The main the main problem isn't even necessarily the distraction for me. It's like I'm so quick to like get frustrated and overwhelmed and angry. And I think it's because I, I just get so overwhelmed from like dumb, like from nothing. Um, not so much when I'm like streaming, but like in my daily life, it can be kind of overwhelming. And then it like leads me to getting really stressed and really angry out of nowhere. Um, so I want to learn how to like deal with that. Honestly, as bad as the meds sound, if you find out you actually need them, it's so worth it. Yeah, I listen, no, I've got no stigma against the medication at all. Like I think uh, my sister is on ADHD medication. Like it runs in my family. <laughs> so so and, and like also I have other family members who are medicated. Like I don't think there's anything wrong with being medicated if you need to be. I just would, my whole thing is I want that to be like a last resort. You know what I mean? I want to, um, do all the other things that I can do first to avoid getting put on a medication because I worry that, you know, medic I'd rather not be on another medication for life. I'm already on like an antihistamine for my life because I'm allergic to everything. Um, I'm already on spironolactone for acne. Like, I don't want to keep adding medications. You know what I mean? It just feels like a lot. So I, I want to try other things first. Let's see. Who knows? Maybe... The psychiatrist will tell me I actually don't have ADHD and I'm just fucking weird. And the, I have a different problem. I don't really know. I'm just kind of, the evaluation has been inconclusive so far. <laughs> 
But we'll see. I'm excited that I get to finally meet with somebody. I'm just, I'm just excited to learn more about my brain. Danny, welcome to the Golden Nuggets. Thank you so much for joining. Oh my God, you're right. I keep getting distracted from the um, House of Dragon trailer. We do need to watch that. But I'm kind of enjoying chatting with you guys. It's like a cozy, cozy stream day. It's a chatty day. My autistic ass gets that gets like that a lot as well. Thankfully, my friend keeps me feeling happy. Dude, I have a friend who's on the spectrum and she or has ASD. Sorry, I don't know what the correct terminology is, but <clears throat> she was like, <laughs> I was describing to her <laughs> my symptoms and she was like, I don't know, maybe you have ASD. <laughs> I was like, oh my God, <laughs> I don't know what it is, but there's something going on. <laughs> or it's just that I'm on the internet too much. And, you know, maybe like the internet has just caused brain rot and like I can't focus anymore because I'm just so used to like stimulation. Who knows? I'm glad I'm glad medication worked for you, Pandora Wombat. That's great. I mean, like, that's the thing is like I know people who definitely need it. Like they function so much better. They're so much happier when they're on it. So I'm definitely pro medication for for when people need it. I just would rather try other things first um just don't make ADHD your whole personality I mean I I I don't I don't I don't see that happening um yeah a friend yeah a friend on the spectrum. it is a friend Baron it is a friend god damn it <laughs> texted me I always get nervous that when my mom texts me it's like she's watching the stream <laughs> oh no she didn't oh she just met Jay Leno at the airport so that's exciting <laughs> just wanted to tell you what my mom is up to uh Kiazi thank you so much for the tier one Calv123987 Thank you so much for the bits. That's a lot of numbers. I have a comedy gig in my local bar tonight. Would it be too much to open with a penis joke? Uh, I mean, depends on the joke, I think. How, you know, is it is it your best material? Do you think, like, also, are all of your jokes kind of like that? <laughs> because then it's setting the tone. You got to set the tone for the night. So it does depend on the audience too, which that's not really helpful information because. <clears throat> but good luck with the comedy gig. Good for you. That's ter honestly terrifying um, to do stand up. It's it's really impressive when people do that, like mad props. Um, I've always thought about it, but I'm like, mm -hmm. I'm kind of chicken shit. Name drop. Yeah, name dropping. <laughs> yeah, I just ran into Jay Leno at the airport. No big deal. <laughs> He like asked me, who are you? <laughs> My family is so cool. <laughs> but is it funny? True. That's all that really matters. If it's funny. Has she played Stardew Valley before? Yes, I have. Okay. Speaking of which, I think we should get into this trailer. <clears throat> well, if it's the opening. <laughs> At least give me a drink first. That's what I say. Is there a drink minimum? And are you opening? Are you like starting? That's actually a good question. Okay. If you're starting, I'd say no. If you're going on a little later into the night, yes, it's probably fine. And if nobody laughs, you could probably just say something like, well, that's weird. Your mom loved that one. Like, but that might alienate them more, so don't listen to me. Um, okay. Are you ticklish? What the fuck? Why? Why are you asking a question like that? <laughs> the fuck? Um, sus. It is sus. <laughs> it was great that they decided to do two separate shows. Yeah, I heard they did two... Separate trailers for House of the Dragon. So we got a wow. No, I don't understand. I didn't mean to be weird. 
I'm sorry. Okay, it's fine. You can stay. <laughs> um, dick joke to a sober crowd might be off-putting compared to a drunk crowd. Exactly. Like, I think if they've had a few drinks, you can go for it. Um, I can totally understand why you've chosen something wholesome, easy, and cute after putting yourself through living hell 70 to 4 times. <laughs> yeah, and like, honestly, I do want to come back to uh, Elden Ring. I do. Um, I'm not going to play the whole thing because I don't have, you know, I'm not that sadistic. But I, I you know, I, I did enjoy it, so I will revisit it. Okay, let's, let's get into... These trailers that I keep putting off. Um, hold on a moment. Let me put you guys over here. Hold on. Okay. Pause the music. Bring up this. Okay. There we go. Okay. Make sure you can hear it. Yeah, you can hear it. Okay, I'm so excited. This is the official <clears throat> trailer. And I'm assuming that this second one is the one that was released on their House of the Dragon channel over here. But then there's also this. The green trailer. Black trailer. Oh, I have been hearing people saying something like, black or green, you must pick. And I'm like, what? Ooh, oh boy. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, we're watching the black trailer first, and then we're watching the green trailer. Okay, I'm so excited. All must choose. My father chose me. He did. That's true. He did. To succeed him. He didn't do a really great job making sure that information was known. Until death. He was kind of confused. Well, yeah, he did. He just was kind of confusing about it. Alison's son sits my throne. Mm -hmm. I mean to fight this war and win it. The realm will soon tear itself apart. If men do not remember the oath sworn to King Viserys and to his rightful heir. Mm -hmm. The high towers are marching. You must crush this beast at its head. Our terms are very simple. Renounce the false king and bend the knee to the queen. Or your house burns. Mm-hmm. When the desire to kill and burn takes hold and reason is forgotten. Mm -hmm. You will not even remember what began the war in the first place. That's true. That woman is always speaking truth. She's got the best head on her shoulders. Fear what I've begun. You know, she's a mama after vengeance for her son, though, too. So, oh, I have goosebumps. Oh, it's not over. Oh, don't pause it. It's not over. Maybe it is over. They're just going to. Oh, no. What? Huh? Oh, it's like. See the other side. Time for the green trailer. I, I, I already think I'm team black, but here we go. No, you're not the one true king. There was a misunderstanding. Your mom is confused. Many weeks ago, my lord husband was alive. And the realm was at peace. On his deathbed, he knew the realm would never accept a queen. Mm-mm, no, you misunderstood him. Rhaenyra's supporters will believe what they wish. They believe the truth. Cyrus wanted Egon to succeed him. No, he did not. Now, not for the good of the realm, but for the satisfaction of vengeance. Yeah, maybe they do want vengeance a little bit, but I kind of don't blame them. And I will pay it back a hundred times over. I'm as fearsome as any of them. No, you're not. You have no idea the sacrifices that were made to put you on that throne. He's just a boy. Sit down, child. That guy is scary. His brother is actually scary. But you must accept that the path to victory now is one of violence. Good. 
to war then. In my life, I've endeavored to serve both my house and the realm. And somehow none of it matters. Hold to your courage for the one true king, Aegon! Uh oh. Stream may be temporarily blocked. Can, every you can the stream's still live, right? <laughs> I was getting a copyright warning, um, which makes sense when I do trailers like this. That happens, but I just want to make sure the stream stays up. I think we're okay. Yeah, we're good. Um, I'm Team Black. Fuck Team Green. Uh uh. Not my king. Hashtag not my king. <laughs> Copyright strike live. I mean, if it was a strike, I'd the channel would be yoinked, but or not the channel, the video would be yoinked. I think we're okay. I think it was just warning me like I'll probably this will probably be demonetized, which is totally fine. Natalia, thank you so much for the super chat. I need a period horror story from you right now. No. <laughs> Pass. <laughs> thank you for the super chat though. Um, <clears throat> uh, Cal, thank you for the bits again. It's the last act of the night, but my friend the other day started the show with what's the difference between getting a divorce and getting circumcised, so I should be good. Yeah, go for it then. Trust your gut. Have fun. Break legs. I feel for Allison, but I'm leaning towards Team Black. Yeah, I feel for her, but she's just misunderstood. Not misunderstood. She misunderstood Viserys. How is that worth $2? I don't know. But, you know, <laughs> it's the life of a streamer. <laughs> um, yeah, I think Warner Brother does that a lot with streams. I mean, yeah, with the trailers, it's always kind of a risk because the music is always so present and stuff. Um, but yeah, oh my God, those were epic. I'm really, I'm really excited. Did it even say, I'm going to mute this real quick. Did it even say when it's coming out? June 16th. Oh, that's still like a wheez away. I wish it was soon. But I'm excited. <laughs> Asking the real questions. Yeah, exactly. Okay. I think... I think it's time for Stardew Valley. I feel like we're ready now to get into it. I'm not going to watch any more trailers. Penguin tra I'm good, guys. No, we just were watching House of the Dragon. That's all I wanted to watch. <laughs> I want to get into Stardew. It's not a, it's not a trailer watching stream. <clears throat> oh, it's loud. Hold on. Oh. Okay. It's loud. There we go. Got a little quieter. So, typically I play with like the music totally off, but it loads in the screen. So I'm gonna show you my farm. This is Karen. A little loud. There we go. This is Karen. Okay. I kind of named her that because I thought it would be funny. Um, I'm also tormenting Lewis. So I have little sunglasses. I found these in a tree. <laughs> oh, it's the day of the luau. Okay. Well, don't worry. We're not going to. You know what? Crap. Okay. Today's the day of the luau. So I do want to do one thing for y'all because I don't want to forget this one thing that I have to do. Um, I've been holding on to something very special all year. So this is my farm. Got two little recycling machines over here, some furnaces, Pierre's special shipping bin because I did a task for him, my crystallarium making diamonds on repeat, my battery maker thing, my lightning rod. I'm planting a bunch. I got a lot of star fruit. I think these are some ancient fruits. I got my rare crows. Got some melons. Another more rare crows, more star fruit, ancient fruit, random ass things over here. Oh, I got a little squash. Um, got my little fruit bat cave that never has any fucking fruit in it. Oh yay, there's a cherry. 
<laughs> it takes forever to get fruit. I got a mill. I've been making rice. That's a new thing I'm doing. Um, I have a second pet water bowl. And yet, hold on, where have I been keeping it? Am I? No, 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 no. This. Um, I have a second pet water bowl, but I only have one pet right now. But the new thing in the update is you can get a second pet. So, oh yeah, my fish loves me. So, or my cat loves me. So it drops fishes sometimes. That's exciting. Anyway, um, what, what did I want to show you? This. I have Lewis's purple shorts. I have still not returned them. I would like to give them to the soup at the Lua. <laughs> so that's what I'm going to do today. That's what we're going to do. Um, we'll do that and then I'll make a new farm because I just, I have to, I can't forget to put the shorts in the soup for the luau. I do not have sweet potatoes. I have some summer squash. Um, it's summer. There's my piggy. I have two goats. Uh, this is Bertrude. This is Wilbur. He's new. This is Gertrude. Gertrude is the mother of Bertrude. This is Nilla. I should be milking them, but I don't, whatever. It's fine. That's, uh, what's your name? Branny. This is Birdie. She's brand new. This is my OG chicken, Bobo. <laughs> this is Gato, <laughs> which I love that name for him. Where's the duck? I can never find the duck in the grass because he's green. Oh, God. The luau's begun. We got to go. Oh, there he is. My little duck. Fry. Okay, let's go. I'm just going to walk. Fuck it. I have a horse, but I don't care. Uh, what's this? Nope. Ah. Oh, more summer squash seeds. Just what I needed. All right, let's go to the beach. Oh, also, if you want to see my relationships, I am dating Leah because she's a queen. My goal, though, I don't want to propose to her until... I get everybody else to 10 hearts. I'm not going to, I don't necessarily, well, I think I have to date them all to get them to 10 hearts. So there's, I, I don't want to date everybody because I don't want to trigger a cutscene where they all hate me. Um, I'm not in the mood for that. But I want to get most of them to 10 hearts so I can just see their, oh, look, she's, Maru's outfit changed. She's in her nurse outfit. She must be working right now or something. I want to get them all to 10 hearts so I can see their 10 heart scenes. <laughs> Is this the new Elden Ring DLC? Yes. <clears throat> oh my god, they're all in their working uniforms. I've never seen this before. Well, the rest aren't. Just those two. I have not put in any work with Dwarf or Krobus yet. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Go to the Luau. I'm also carrying around this hot pepper to give to Shane just randomly so that he'll like me more. Oh, hi, Kent. How's it going? Are you friends with my son? Yes. You probably know him better than I do. Yeah, well, you should work on that. Okay. I just date you for the special cutscene. Exactly. Yep. Wee! Hi, Maru. <clears throat> This bench has been cooking in the sun all day. Well, why are you still sitting on it? <laughs> uh, I'm not going to talk to them yet. Alex, do you think if I went in the water, other people would follow? I don't want to be a solo swimmer. Just, you know, do you, King. Uh, don't block the sun. I'm in the right spot to avoid getting any tailings. Jesus Christ. Harvey, uh, I can't wait for a bowl of piping hot soup. What? Really? <laughs> Emily's dancing. It's all in the hips. I think I need to take a break. I'm getting sweaty. Why do humans... <laughs> Demetrius! Why do humans enjoy dancing? Perhaps it is an instinctual mechanism so that we will inadvertently convey our genetic quality to potential mates. Demetrius, you are such a loser. Why are you one of my best friends in this game? He's like... I'm like I think he's like my second or third best friend in this game. He's so, so weird. Demetrius, it's because it's fun. Thank you, Robin. God, some sanity. Shane, I'll never turn down free food. 
same. Ah, uh, can you smell that? It's a signal that the roast is almost ready. I love Linus. He's so precious. Okay, Vincent. <clears throat> Why can't I go play by the tide pools? Because it's a dangerous kid. I've heard the summer season gets very busy for farmers. Make sure you don't overwork yourself. Hi, Kent. I just talked to you outside. Smells are powerful for bringing back memories. That can be good or bad. <laughs> oh, God. Elliot, hello. Why can't I talk to you? Oh, there we go. The luau, all the hustle and bustle of town, brought right to my very doorstep. Okay. Hello, dude. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Soup, dancing? No, thank you. I'm perfectly content right here. Besides, someone needs to keep watch in case a monster appears. <laughs> oh, my God. This dude is like that, that guy that just, like, never lets his guard down at an event and, like, always has to seat, be seated near the exit and, like, have a weapon on him at all times and is ready to go, you know, just, like, got an itchy trigger finger <clears throat> isn't it wonderful to see our community come together like this i try my best to treasure these moments you're so precious penny next year i gotta remember to bring my electric guitar imagine a solo at this part of the song all right my dad's obsessed with the governor's visit everything has to be perfect i think he's hoping to be mayor someday god pray for us all i do not want pierre as mayor leah I can't seem to decide what to eat. There's too many options to choose from. Munch, this festival always has the best food. Gus, use my potatoes to make several dishes for the buffet. So what kind of ingredient are you adding to the soup? Oh, I have a special ingredient, Caroline. Don't you worry. Hi, George. Leek and garlic mashed potatoes. I think I've died and gone to heaven. Oh my God, George is happy for once. Look at him, he's smiling. <clears throat> So cute. He never smiles. Abigail's dreams. Abigail's definitely like the e-girl of the bunch, the gamer girl, you know. I married her um, when I played to Ginger Island. She, or no, I didn't. I'm lying. I romanced her and Sebastian the most, and I got all their cutscenes, and then I picked Sebastian. But I was almost picked Abigail. I was really torn. <clears throat> Is this your first playthrough? No. I haven't played like all of the content, but I did a lot the last time I played. So this is my second time. Evelyn, now don't overeat, dear. I wouldn't want you getting a stomach ache. Well, thank, thank you, Grandma. All right. Do I need anything? Probably not. No. All right. I think I haven't talked to Jazz. I don't think I've talked to Pam either. Do I have to eat it? Uh, you probably shouldn't eat it once I put the shorts in. <laughs> One bad ingredient. Girl in the whole soup. Oh, goody. Can't wait. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I'm going to need more of this. Okay, I think I've talked to everybody, except for Marnie. Let me talk to Marnie over here. She's just going to tell me to throw the ingredient in. All right, guys, here it is. The moment. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Hi, Mayor. <laughs> Don't eat the soup, okay? Don't eat it. All right. <clears throat> I expect you to be on your best behavior. <laughs> <laughs> Should we move forward? Yeah. Oh, crap. I meant to say yes. Yes. <laughs> Marnie will recognize the flavor. <laughs> yes, she will. <laughs> I'm pleased to announce that the potluck ceremony has begun. I have high hopes that you all contributed high quality ingredients. We want to leave the governor with a good impression now. Well, Governor, would you indulge us with an honorary first tasting? I would be delighted. I've been eyeing the soup all afternoon. Oh, boy. He's going to get sick. I'm so nervous. <laughs> it's a bit tangy. <laughs> the flavor is quite good. Just one minute. There's something in my bowl. <laughs> this, this is outrageous. <laughs> I've never been so insulted in all my life. <laughs> my tongue is swelling up. I think I'm gonna be sick. He's already green. Ah! 
Whoever took part in this appalling act is truly reprehensible. Using my very private item for this sick purpose and to ruin a perfectly good soup. <laughs> Unforgivable. I have never been more ashamed of this community. <laughs> truly disgusting. Maybe you shouldn't make other people go looking for your purple shorts, Lewis. Like ever think about that you brought this on yourself by sending out a letter to a new member of the community asking her to go look for your fucking shorts like a psychopath. <laughs> <laughs> He's so upset. Go home. The festival is over. <laughs> Worth it. I guess the little prank didn't go over too well. I love it. I love it. Do I still get to keep them? <laughs> I still have them. That's amazing. Okay, that's great. That was worth it. That's all I needed to do. Now, uh, we can go make a new farm with all y'all. Damn, Lewis is pissed. Honestly, totally satisfying. Totally worth it. Exit to title, new. Um, Zanzibar White, thank you so much for the bits. Bart Simpson is smiling right now. I'm not sure I get, I get it, but thank you. Oh. Sorry for the loud music. <clears throat> okay female what do we can I just this, this music is so loud even though I don't okay whatever um eat my shorts as a Bart catchphrase oh sorry I, I don't I haven't really watched a lot of the Simpsons to be honest with you sorry oh what is the new farm type okay standard beach meadowlands is that the new one meadowlands Four Corners, Monts, Wilderness, Hilltop, Forest. Yeah, Riverland. I think Meadowlands is the new one. Meadow. It's not the best for growing crops, but there's a... So, it's not the best for growing crops, but there's chewy blue grass that animals love. So you basically are like... You're committed to ranching. You start with two chickens. I mean, I guess we can do that. Do you guys want to see the Meadowlands farm? I, if I wasn't going to do that, I would do the Wilderness Farm with all the monsters, because I think that'd kind of be funny. I'm like between... I, I don't know if the Meadowlands one really, like, tempts me by the idea that you can't plant. Either or. Let me do a poll. Well... I'd have to do a poll on... No, you know what? Let's do it like this because I'd have to do a poll on Twitch and YouTube. Put a one in the chat if you want Meadowlands and put a two in the chat if you want the Wilderness Farm. like pretty split you can plant stuff on the metal lines farm yeah it just seems like it's not ideal for growing crops two two one it's pretty even i think there's like slightly more twos than ones <clears throat> three you're one of those people android <laughs> i think i'm gonna go with wilderness then no, I'm not going to do a poll, Nolan, because there's two. I have Twitch and YouTube here, so I'd have to do two polls. So that's why I'm doing it like this. All right, we're going to do Wilderness. 12. <laughs> Thanks, Zanzibar. Okay, what should my name be? Oh, I can randomize my look? Oh, my God. Oh, she pretty. She's cute. the name just maybe Natalia maybe I'll just do Natalia what should the name of the farm be <gasps> golden farms I wish I could change this to plural golden farms 
the character has your hair. Yeah, that's the closest to... Well, she's got like little piggy tails almost, but... I actually don't like the back of her head now that I'm noticing that. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, goody. <laughs> She's so pretty. <laughs> That's a little better. I like it when the hair is just hair. If that makes sense. Oh, favorite thing. Yeah, what should the... You gotta pick a favorite thing. We gotta pick an animal, too. I think we should go with a dog. Oh, this is a new dog with a bandana! Is he new? And I think the black cat is new, too. The black cat is kind of cute, too. Do we go with the dog with a bandana? Or the black cat? Since we're live, this is what I'm going to say my favorite thing is. <laughs> the dog. This is not my first playthrough at all, Perga. Bandana dog. I do think the bandana dog is pretty cute. Okay, we're going with bandana dog. Okay. I think this is fine. I mean, well... I like that my pants are brown. Let's make it like a dark denim kind of color. Ooh. getting lost in the pixel shirts. This is the shirt that I have in the other game, but... kind of cute. <sighs> Lobster is a new game option but for pets. I saw that you could adopt a turtle now. Okay, I think this is good. I think we're ready to go. Natalia! Wakey, wakey! Oh, do we skip? Can we skip the... Oh, should we skip this intro or no? Do you guys want to see the intro? I guess we can play it through. I've seen it before. We'll see if there's anything new about it. I don't think there will be, but... I want you to have this sealed envelope. Um, um, no, no, no. Don't open it yet. Have patience. Oh, Grandpa's dying. Now listen close. Look at the sword on the top of the fireplace here. Grandpa was a baddie. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. And your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. When that happens, my dear, you'll be ready for this gift. 
I mean, he's just I love how like theoret he's basically just letting his farm decay and his house falling apart until I'm ready to open the envelope, you know? He couldn't just tell me in that moment, like, I'm leaving you my farm. But I, he knew I wasn't ready yet, you know? Working at Joja! Is it a coffin? Did he gift a coffin? <laughs> Look at this guy! He looks like he should live at Stardew. Oh my god! There I am, just hating my life. Living in my sad little cubicle. Life's better with Joja. I can't handle it anymore. I must go. Zanzibar, thank you so much for the gifted membership. Crispy Chips, thank you for the super chat. Have you played Detroit Becoming Human? No, I have not. I'm writing a note. <gasps> I'm opening the letter. <gasps> Dear Natalia, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I lost sight of what mattered most in life. Real connections with other people and nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I've enclosed the deed to that place. My pride and joy that I've let fall into ruin over the years since I've been gone. <laughs> Golden Farm. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This is my most precious gift of all. Now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, dear. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will you? <laughs> Here we go! We're going. On the road again. You know what's funny, too? We're going to show up. Like, I don't even know if they're giving me a weapon because I've never done the wilderness farm before. There's going to be monsters. So hopefully they give me a weapon. I'm just going to show up. There's going to be, like, zombies and spiders and bats. Oh, hello, Robin. <clears throat> you must be Natalia. I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Mayor Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. He's right... There now, tidying things up for your arrival. The farm's right over here if you'll follow me. Oh, I thought I was going to actually have to follow her for a second. The scythe works as a weapon. Oh, well, good. Here it is. The farm. This is Golden Farm. I'm, oh. It's horrible. <laughs> What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good soil underneath that mess. With a little dedication, you'll have it cleaned up in no time. <clears throat> I just expected it to be, like, in perfect condition. And here we are, your new home. Hello. Ah, the new farmer. My mortal enemy. <laughs> just kidding. Welcome, I'm Lewis, mayor of Pelican Town. You know, everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. All right. <clears throat> so you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. It's a good house. Very rustic. <laughs> oh, it just pans up slightly. Rustic. That's one way to put it. Crusty might be a little more apt, though. <laughs> Rude. No, whatever. It's fine. I don't care. She's cool. I love Robin. Don't listen to her, Natalia. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied so that you buy one of her house upgrades. Louis, what the fuck? <laughs> Relax, bro. Relax. Oh, she feels called out. She's like, oh, I've been called out on the carpet. <laughs> you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. Tomorrow, you ought to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. Yep, I got to introduce myself to everybody again. This game is dangerous. You will lose hours, days, and weeks, and you will not notice. Yeah, no, I've I've done it before. <laughs> this, is, this is not my first rodeo okay i have given many hours of my life to this game the townspeople would appreciate that all right here we go look she's still giving him side eye look at her tapping her little foot i almost forgot if you have anything to sell just place it in this box here i'll come by during the night to collect it good luck yep thank you i know what to do oh oh Morning. Here we go. Parsnip seeds. Here we go. Yes. 
You received parsnip seeds. Here's a little something to get you started. Getting started. Cultivate and harvest a parsnip. Greet the townsfolk. Well. Wee! Wee! I love the fiber noises. It's so satisfying to me. Oh. Pop, pop. Stuck behind a tree. All right, I should probably just clear some land right here so that I can plant a parsnip. I do need to learn how to build a scarecrow because they're going to eat my parsnips. All right. <clears throat> oh, let's cut the other way. <laughs> The dopamine receptors are going. They are. They're going. I feel it. <laughs> Sorry. Will you be co-oping this game with a partner? I, I've not planned on, on, on doing that. I haven't even asked anyone if I know if they're, anyone I know if they're playing it, to be honest. I just love this game. And I would have been playing it today anyway. I would have been playing on my other farm, but I was like, it'll be fun to start a new farm with people. Oh, goodness. Oh, okay. Here we go. Let's hoe it out. <laughs> Five. One, two, three. Four, five, one, two, three, four, five. Oh, I found mixed seeds too. I can plant those too. Two mixed seeds. <clears throat> okay, time to water. And then I can go greet the townsfolk. And try to find some food, because I'm starving. All righty, let's go meet some people. Can't wait to meet Shane. <laughs> and have him tell me that he hates me. <clears throat> no, I'm not playing Elden Ring today, obviously. <laughs> this is not Elden Ring. Let's go get familiarized with the calendar. All right, let's go into Pierre's, I'm sure. Oh, there isn't a cutscene. interesting. Hello, Pierre. Hello, the new farmer. I'm Pierre, local of the general store. If you're looking for seeds, my shop is a place to go. I'll also buy produce from you for a good price. I thought this was going for a second, I guess not. Marnie! Mayor Lewis told me you just arrived, I'm Marnie. I sell livestock and animal products at my ranch. You should swing by sometime. Great. Gus. Hello there, I'm Gus, chef and owner of the Star Drop Saloon. I'm getting some supplies. Pierre's got the good stuff. All right. Abigail. Oh, that's right. I heard someone new was moving to that old farm. It's kind of a shame, really. I always enjoyed exploring those overgrown fields by myself. Girl, you can come over anytime. You are cool. Your mom never comes out of her room, so I'm going to find her later. What if Elden Ring was in this style? That actually would be so funny. <laughs> All right, let's see. Can I even search in trash cans yet, or do I not have that capability? We should test it. Alex! Hey, you're the new girl, huh? I think we're going to get along great. I'm Alex. I'll see you around. You know, sometimes Alex is so nice, and then other times he's just such a douche. It's just really hit or miss. Oh, I can look in the trash. That's cool. A Coca-Cola or a Joja Cola. Sorry. All right, let's go meet 
See if anyone's at the museum. Boop. No one but no one but this guy. I don't think I even need to talk to him. Oh, hello there. Welcome to the Stardew Valley Archaeological Office. This is embarrassing, but the previous curator made off of the entire collection. We don't have any artifacts for display, but I'm hoping to remedy that soon. Hey, if you find out any artifacts or minerals there, would you let me know? Yep. I would do that for you. Maybe. <gasps> Algae! Hello, Clint. He's my... Ugh. He's my least favorite. I'm the town blacksmith. If you ever need to upgrade your tools, I'm your guy. If you guys play this game, who do you hate? Who's the one that you hate the most? Clint is my least favorite. <clears throat> Definitely Clint. And then probably followed by maybe Lewis. I mean, Haley and Alex are both annoying. Shane is annoying, but I think he's just like, he's one of those guys who's rude, but it's just because he's miserable in his own head. I don't really care that he's mean to be honest penny come back penny i gotta talk to you come here hello i'm penny <laughs> thank you <laughs> his cheeks annoy me whose cheeks clint the creek clint is just such a weirdo like he just bemoans the fact that he can never get with emily and i'm like just go fucking talk to her dude hello little child <laughs> Oh, stranger, my name's Vincent. Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay because you're in our fucking house. Hi, Jody. Oh, you weren't exactly how I imagined, but that's okay. I'm Jody. It's a quiet little town, so it's very exciting when someone new moves in. Having a farmer around can really change things. Is your son home? No. <laughs> Beach guy. You don't like Elliot? Uh, or you don't mean Willie, right? Willie's a gem. I love Willie. I could see. I know some people don't like Elliot. I don't really mind Elliot. He's a little pretentious, but I don't really mind him, to be honest. You search trash. Clint is the weirdo. Sure. Listen. Oh, I need wood to fix this. Yep. Can't. I don't think I can go into Elliot's house. Yeah. I'll find him eventually. Maybe he's at the dock. Nope. But I bet Willie's working. Oh. Just kidding. No, he's not. Because the game is not ready for me to fish yet. All right. Recycling is better than stalking. True. Clint is fucking weird, okay? Let's go up to the mountains. Oh, Evelyn, hello. Hello, welcome to our little community. You can call me Granny if you like. Oh, you're so sweet. <gasps> Caroline, you left your room. I'm so proud of you. You must be Natalia, the new, I'm the new, uh, the new farmer. I'm Caroline. Nice to meet you. My husband runs a general store here. Have you met my daughter, Abigail? She's the pale one with the purple hair. Yes, I have. Harvey. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm the local doctor. I perform regular checkups and medical procedures for all the residents. It's rewarding work. Oh, he's a talker. I hope you'll find your own work equally rewarding in time. Yes, thank you. Okay, let's go. Up to the park. Damn it, I'm getting a craving to get back into this game. I just beat this addiction. Yeah, it's a recurring addiction for me. Like, I go through phases with this game. A daffodil. Oh, that sound is so satisfying. Oh, I can't pick up the seeds. I need to. There we go. I don't think I can go in here yet. It's going to be locked. Um, Caroline gives the best recipe. Yeah, for the tea sapling. Or do you mean like for food? <gasps> A leak! Oh, I can't pick that up either. What do I do? Oh, no. I should have put things away at my house. I'd rather have the leek than the mixed seeds. I always get rid of mixed seeds first. Okay. Hello, sir. Greetings. I'm Demetrius, local scientist and father. Thanks for introducing yourself. <laughs> Could you imagine, like, in real life, if you just went up to somebody and they were like, thanks for introducing yourself. 
I'd be like, oh, yeah, uh-huh. I'm studying the local plants and animals from my home laboratory. Have you met my daughter, Maru? She's interested to meet you. Nope. But I will. Don't worry. It sounds so creepy, the way that I said it. I think I've already... Oh! What the fuck? I have never seen this. Is this just to block off this area right now? Oh, I forgot that you get like a letter from Jojamart about there being a rock in the way. I've never actually seen that rock. I've never actually come this far in the beginning. Oh, this is going to be closed now. Robin! Have you met everyone in town yet? That sounds like... No, I haven't. I haven't met your kid! Oh, I can go in here. Oh, sorry. Sorry. It's getting a little carried away. I don't think she's home. Okay. I bet Sebastian is home, chilling in his room. Yeah, he is. I'm just going to wait out here and see if they come outside. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> no one's going to get past me. <laughs> Let's see. Who have I met? I have met pretty much most people. I haven't met Lewis. What? Oh, no. I just haven't talked to him today. I haven't met Maru, Elliot, Sam, Shane, Leah, George, Haley, Emily. There's a lot of people. I haven't met Linus. Why did I? Oh, I talked to him in the luau. I haven't met him in the game. In this game. Hold on. Excuse me, sir. I have to talk to you. Stranger, hello. Don't mind me. I just live out here alone. <laughs> That's actually like such a weird... Don't mind me. Just living out here alone. <laughs> such a weird sentence. Um, <clears throat> I haven't met you, kid. Yeah, I don't think I want you near my kid. Yeah, exactly. Linus is the best. I do love Linus a lot. I love Linus. I love Willie so much. <clears throat> He's cute. I love I love the old men. Not all the old men. Lewis is annoying. I'd like Lewis more if he would just admit that he loved Marnie and would be open about their relationship. But he's like, ugh, no one can know that I'm that I'm with Marnie. It would be unprofessional as a politician. I'm like, what? You're not allowed to date anybody? You're not like a priest. I said I was going to wait, but I'm not waiting. I'm trying to find Maru. Or somebody. Just anybody. Please. Hello. Maybe I'll just go to the bar. Who's at the bar? It's a Monday. If anybody's at the bar, that's actually concerning. Pam will be here. I can say hi to Pam and Emily and Shane. Hello. Nice to meet you. Nothing like a sip of the good stuff to warm these old bones. Oh, you still want to talk. Oh, no. You're just repeating. Okay. Emily. <clears throat> I can read it on your face. You're going to love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. Well, honey, we're here right now. <laughs> I think Pam is objectively the word. Pam's pretty awful, too, to be honest. I don't know you. Why are you talking to me? Nice meeting you. Pam is pretty awful. That's true. Ugh, Clint. All right, you know, I'll just meet the others tomorrow because I'm going to go home and there's going to be monsters. So I'm a little, I shouldn't go this way, should I? This is probably the worst way to go home because I'm going to have to walk past monsters. Oh, let's see. I'm excited. I've never, let's get the scythe ready. <laughs> oh boy. Why is she at the bar already? Dude, Pam is at the bar the minute it is five o'clock. Oh, this was a bad idea. I forgot about all the foliage. Oh, God. I've made a mistake. Oh, boy. There's no monsters yet, so that's good. <clears throat> Oh, I went. Where did I go? Why did I do this? Oh, my God. Oh! <laughs> I'm panicking. I need to calm down. <laughs> Mistakes were made. That was not a smart decision. Your cam is blocking the date and time, just FYI. Oh. Yeah, you're right. Let me. Where should I put this? Because it's going to block something. I don't want it to. 
maybe I'll just hold on. Maybe I'll do this, but like shrink it and then flip it. Is that better? This is probably better, right? Just block the energy. I mean, I feel like this is this is good because I'm not I'm probably not blocking as much this way. <clears throat> no clock block. I, I removed the clock block. <laughs> okay, no queen of sauce yet. What's this? Oh, you know what? We gotta turn the fireplace on. I love having the fire going. <gasps> A letter! I keep finding cool stuff, but my backpack is full. Does this sound like you? Well, Pierre's got you covered. Stop by Pierre's General Store today. Check out our affordable size 24 backpack. I can't afford that yet, Pierre. Just got back from a fishing trip. You should come back to the beach sometime. I've got something for you. Uh, honestly, reading it like that sounds kind of weird, Willie. I'm not going to lie. I've got something for you. Come by my house. Can't just say, I have a fishing rod I want to give you. <laughs> now the logo on your hat is backwards. <laughs> it, it is what it is. I'm not moving it again if it's not that big of a deal. <laughs> um, I don't think I can craft anything yet, can I? Oh, I can. Yes. Uh-oh. Mistakes were made. Uh-oh. We're just going to... No, we're going to throw out the sap. Okay, where do I want to put this chest? Mm -mm. Wood, rocks, fiber. Put this in here. Okay, great. All right, I watered. I guess I can clear more. I should go meet more people. Oh, it's just so satisfying. Oh, leave it on the floor and pick it back up. Crap! I wasn't thinking about that, Shady. You're so smart. Why don't I do that? I need to do that. I wasn't thinking. I picked the same farm. Yeah, I've never played this wilderness farm before. I'm kind of excited. Come here. I love having a magnet ring. It blocks the dialogue now? Okay, you know what we're gonna do? <laughs> Thanks, Chewy Elephant. I appreciate it. We're gonna do this again. How's that? That should be better. I got to go to the beach. Oh, oh, let's just go. Let's just go. Let me put some things away, though. Hold on. I really should plant this, but I'll, I'll plant it later. No, no, I'll plant it now. We have time. This is just a regular Stardew Valley, but they did a new patch, Lord Mortarius. Oh, no, it's blocking the upper middle of the right side of the screen. <laughs> You know what? You know what? You know what? How's how's this, guys? How's this? Okay. 
I think we're back. I, I don't know what just happened there. OBS, like, I went to go make the camera visible again, and then it just totally froze and freaked out. That was crazy. I'm scared it's going to happen again, to be honest. I guess we'll see. <laughs> oh, man. Sorry about that, y'all. Freaking OBS. Okay. What were we doing? <sighs> Going to the beach. Oh. Let's not mess with the settings again. Yeah, clearly. Could not handle that. This game isn't even like a crazy game. It doesn't like use a lot of energy or GPU or whatever. Hi, Lewis. Good. Your grandpa used to complain about the rickety old bed, but I think deep down he actually loved that house. Every time I refreshed, oh, Willie, cutscene. Every time I refreshed, all I see is her laughing, saying, you know what, you know what, how's this? And then the stream just crashed. <laughs> That's pretty funny, I'm not going to lie. Ahoy there, miss. Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet you. I don't really know what accent I'm doing right now. Ah, I'm still trying to unwind from a month on the salty seas. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Here, I want you to have me old fishing rod. It's important to me that the artifician stays alive and hey, maybe you'll find something from the shop once in a while. Fishing rod, yay. Do you still have that goofy freeze frame from the Elden stream? Oh yeah! Uh, if you're watching on Twitch, there's good water here in the valley. All kinds of fish. Oh, yeah, my shop's back open now, so come by if you need supplies. Also, buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. That's what my old peppy used to say anyway. Okay. Um, if you're watching on Twitch, the, the, the emote is available of my freeze frame face. I couldn't add it to YouTube, sadly, because YouTube has, like, really strict limits on how many emotes I can add. It's like totally contingent on how many members I have, which is so annoying. Um, but Twitch is a lot more flexible. So the emote is on Twitch, the derpy face emote, if you would like to uh, check it out for yourself. Maybe I should... Let's see. I still need to meet people, but... Let me just try fishing one time. Yeah, there it is. The derp face. Playing this until you beat a boss. Exactly. Okay. I was about to say, this is going to take forever without... Oh, the bar is so little right now. Oh, my God. Yay! Smallmouth bass bait. Oh my god, they have specific baits now for... T he doesn't have regular bait? Maybe because I can't add it to this kind of fishing pole. Okay, it's fine. We, we got a fish. Let's go try to find more people. Why is the time moving so fast? That's just how it is. I also got to cut down more wood so I can repair that bridge. I saw your IG story about the airport fan. <laughs> yes, that was a fun time. Haley, where are you? I don't think she's in there. Where is she? Is she at the park? Lord knows the girl doesn't work. Let's see. 
She is at the park. Hello. You're the new farmer girl or whatever, aren't you? Huh? Oh, I'm Haley. Hmm. If it weren't for those horrendous clothes, you might actually be pretty. Actually, never mind. I regret talking to her. I don't think I've ever actually... You've got some new ideas to sleep on. That's new. I guess I learned something today. Crazy. Uh, George! George never leaves his house, so... Let's see, where is he? Hello! It's irritating to have to meet all these new people, huh? Name's George, by the way, now. Buzz off! Mm. You know, despite how crotchety George is, I really like him. He's allowed to be crotchety. He's been through a lot, you know? He's old. Is anybody here? Oh! Ladies! I think I've actually met all of them. Yeah, I've met... I've met all of them. Okay. Oh, she works all right. Haley? <laughs> uh, I don't know. Wanna, I don't want to know. <laughs> okay, we need to meet Sebastian. We need to meet Maru. Who else? Sam. Sam, Maru, Elliot. Sebastian, Leah, and the wizard, and... Oh, I, oh, I passed Jazz, but I thought I already met her. That was my mistake. Why won't you come outside? Come outside! <laughs> Maru must be at work. Maru! <laughs> I feel like such a creep. Anyone by the lake? Cole. Where are your kids? I gotta go find Jazz again. She's probably at the museum. And Shane, I gotta... Oh no, I already said hi to Shane, right, at the bar. He's kind of easy to pin down. Hello, Abigail. Sam is probably working. Oh! Hello, Jazz. She's not going to like this. Hi. <laughs> Sam! Hey, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. What are you doing over here? Are you just creepily watching Penny and the kids from across the river? Elliot! Hello! Ah, the new farmer we've all been expecting and whose arrival has sparked many a conversation. I'm Elliot. I live in the little cabin by the beach. It's a pleasure to meet you. See, he's a little pretentious, but he's not... He's fine. You know what I mean? Like, so many people will hate him. But I actually don't really mind Elliot. He's nice. He's a little pretentious, but that's fine. Hello, Granny. Oh, is Maru here? Oh, it's closed. Maru! Maru! Where are you? Who have I not met besides Maru and Sebastian? Leah! And the wizard. The wizard is probably going to be last. I, okay, I need to find Leah. But I'm nervous to... Was, Leah doesn't work out, right? I don't think Leah works out. No, she doesn't work out. <laughs> Why wouldn't you... Maru! <laughs> Oh, aren't you the one who just moved in? I'm Maru. I've been looking forward to meeting you. Nice to meet you. Oh, hello. You know, with a small town like this, a new face can really alter the community dynamic. It's exciting. You know, Maru is like, she kind of speaks like her dad, but like less weirdly. Like Maru's more like a human. <laughs> Demetrius says things like, why do humans do this? Isn't it fascinating? Don't we? Let's analyze it. And Maru's just like, oh, it's so nice to meet you. Like, but like has a scientific interest, but she's just like chill. Make sure to tell her that she doesn't work out. 
<laughs> I love Leah. Leah looks like she works out, but she doesn't. She's one of those cool girls, you know. Sebastian! Ooh. Oh my god, my aim sucks. Ah, oh, whatever, the bubbles are gone, fuck it. Is this a speed run? No. I do not speed run this game, I just, I mean, maybe I will one day, because I think that could be kind of funny. Sebastian! Leave your room! Dude! I gotta talk to you! Let's just sit here and see what he does. Now, can you marry the nurse? I mean, I don't know. We're not gonna make it that far. To oh, he's leaving. He's moving. He's moving. Hello? I'm just gonna creepily wait right here. <gasps> Hello? Oh, <laughs> you just moved in, right? Cool. Out of all the places you could live, you chose Pelican Town. <laughs> Okay. You know, I don't think we're going to catch Leah. I think she's probably going to go home. And so we just got to try to catch her tomorrow. I don't, we can't go into the wizard tower. So I don't know how. I don't think we can go into the wizard tower yet. So I don't know how we're going to meet Leah. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Oh, good. It's a regular leak. Thank goodness. Okay. Great. Oh. I gotta put things away. So many things lying on the ground. I could sell this. Okay. Oh, the monsters are gonna come soon. I hear them. Oh my god, it's barely doing anything. This is doing nothing. Okay, I'm gonna like pass out from energy. Like, I just gotta go to bed. <laughs> I need a sword! That is unfortunate. <gasps> Level one foraging. I got wild seeds recipe. I have not seen the outsiders. Tanas, I have not. <sighs> it's raining. I love rainy days. I really would love a queen of sauce episode, but that's fine. Oh. <laughs> Oops. Let's plant more mixed seeds. Why not? Come back for that. Ugh. You have to be crazy accuracy to 
hit a bat with a scythe. I mean, I, I hit it a few times. It just didn't do any damage at all. It's kind of sad. I need a sword. So I need, oh, I just need to meet, oh, so the wizard, I guess, doesn't count for people I need to meet. So I really just need to meet Leah. Okay. Well, let's go try to meet Leah then. Let's, let's put some things away. <laughs> All right. You need to be accurate to kill it. Oh. Oh. All right. Leah. My love. I do love Leah. Excuse me, come outside. I wonder if it's open. Nope. <laughs> Just waiting in the rain for her. <laughs> Ma'am. <laughs> Anyone home? Anytime you open a chest, look at the symbols on the right. I'll try to remember that. Why? It started raining outside my window almost at the same time it started in game. Don't you love when that happens? Hi, Gilbert. I'm doing well. How are you? Leah! Leah! <laughs> I just need to meet you! Come outside! You can stack items into a chest automatically. Oh, I've never done that. I'll have to try to remember to look at that. I'm so used to doing it manually. What was that noise? Yay! A shad! I've eaten too much. I'm nearing a food coma state. I'm honestly hungry, Gilbert. I kind of am thinking about lunch now. I just got dead by daylight flashbacks. <laughs> oh my god, I missed that game. That game was so much fun. Time to kick back, have a couple drinks. Yes, enjoy your weekend. Oh my god, I can't wait for the bar to grow. The little bar is so tiny. Leah! What's on the menu for today? I don't know. I don't know what I want to eat for lunch. little tiny bar. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. Two chubs. Is your door open? No. I'm never going to meet her. Guess I'll just explore. My god. What noise is that? Like a frog? Thai, Indian, Chinese, Danish, Prince, you suggesting all of the food groups. I do love all of those cuisines. I can't really eat Chinese, sadly. Most of the time, it's not safe for gluten-free people. There's like one Chinese restaurant that I can order from here that has a couple dishes that are safe, but I don't, I'm not obsessed with it. Like, I'll get it sometimes, but it's not the best. It's okay.
Why do you need to meet everyone? It's a, it's a little task here. It's one of my little quests. You gotta meet everybody in the town. There's like a lot of different elements to this game. You could do far- there's farming, there's foraging, there's mining, there's combat, there's fishing, and there's like social stuff. So you can like win people over and earn hearts with them and give them gifts, marry them. You get special cutscenes. Leah! Bitch, I just want to say hi. What happens if you ignore everyone? Nothing. The quest just never goes away and you can you can do other things. It's kind of hard to earn like certain recipes and things that you might need without becoming friends with people. Like becoming friends with people has benefits because they'll give you recipes. They'll give you stuff. <sighs> What is, I'm going, I'm going to the wiki. I'm going to the Stardew wiki. Leah's schedule on a Wednesday. What is it? I must know. Spring. Raining. She's going to leave her cottage very soon. We just got to be patient. You're tearing me apart, Leah. <laughs> That's funny. Leah. Dude, I'm giving this girl a horseradish right away. So that I never have to wait outside her cabin ever again. Girl, you picked a good time to move here. The spring is lovely as it's raining. Thank you. D Leah is the easiest person to please ever. How to win friends. Giving gifts. I already did it. Great. Cultivate and harvest a parsnip. I'm still waiting on that one. Okay. Hey, Lewis, how's it going? Season doesn't last forever, you know. Yep. Immediate horse. That's what you should do for all women. Immediate horse radish. Exactly. Women love horse radishes. <laughs> Leah's just the easiest gift receiver. Hi, dude. This weather is not good for sports. Oh, well, I can always lift weights inside. There's the spirit. All right, well... Kind of just waiting for my parsnips to grow. <gasps> I can give Sam a Jojo Cola. Thanks, I really like this. Nothing like a nice cold Jojo Cola on a sopping wet day, huh? Just kidding. Nothing like an... Oh, <laughs> okay, all right. He's broken. Oh, I don't have a key for that. What's this one? Oh, I suck at this game. I suck at it. <laughs> oh, to see... I suck at it. I, oh, God. Ugh! I don't know why. It's like, it's just so hard. Oh, my God. I can't do it. Who, who can do this? This is like, my brain doesn't work this way. It's hard. I don't... It's fine. We're just gonna... We're just gonna go. I thought the way to a girl's heart was cheese. Well, some, some women, not mine. A horseradish isn't it for me either, though. It's probably chocolate, is, is what I would say. I need to keep, I think I need to keep a chub and a shab for the, shad for the community center. So I'm going to pop one into the chest, sell that. Actually, 
Oh, wait. Yeah, you said... Is that what you meant? Oh. I see. That's cool. I don't really know if I like... I like manually organizing it more, but... Personally. But the adding things automatically is cool. I'll definitely use that more. Okay, um, I guess I'll just keep cleaning up the farm. You're married, you don't count. <laughs> I am still a woman. I was once single. about diamonds. I mean, diamonds are nice, but if like a random dude is trying to give me a diamond that I've never met before to woo me, I'd be like, I'd, that would actually be a red flag. I'd be like, what the fuck? A little low on energy here. Okay. I guess we just got to go to bed now. Oh, I meant to do the automat. Whatever. It's fine. Time for bed. Oh, my God. I guess this is because it's the wilderness farm. There's, like, little ghouly figures here on the wall and, like, a shield. I just noticed that. All right. I, I'm going to take a quick pee break, guys. I'll be right back. Right, right back.
Hold on a second, guys. I'll be right back. Okay, sorry guys. I just ordered some food, so it took me a little while. I also got some strawberries, because I'm really hungry and the food's probably going to take a really long time, so. Oh. Here we go. Parsnips are coming along nicely. Up. Oh, like watering plants on the Switch in this game is so much more, like doing anything is so much more annoying on the Switch than it is with a mouse. Let's see, can I, what can I craft? <gasps> I can craft a cobblestone path. Let's do it. I don't like counting, so I'm just kind of. <laughs> Yay! The job I started several months ago is cutting into my YouTube time. Cheryl, that sounds like a toxic environment. You should leave. <laughs> it's a totally toxic environment. I agree. No. no, congrats on the new job. All right, what do I do today? I suppose I could just keep clearing the land. I need to figure out my priorities. You do.
currently on break from a wedding I'm shooting so I could catch the stream. Oh, you're at a wedding right now? Don't let me distract you. Hopefully it's just a a low key distraction cuz dude, wedding photography or videography is so hard. You're like there's so much pressure. Because that's like the person's most important day of their life, theoretically, you know? It's your job to capture it. Oh, my God. I hate not... I really just want a backpack so badly. Backpack, backpack. All right. Let's... I probably can't go to the mines yet, so I guess let's just go... Explore down here more, like, more into the woods. The same song came into my head. <laughs> the intrusive thoughts are winning. I started at 6 a.m. Oh. Oh. Yeah, sounds like a wedding for you. It's freaking insane. We had our wedding photographer. Ah, I hate when I get to the bubbles and they disappear. <laughs> Makes me so angry. Ah, waste of my time. No. I'm pretty sure I can't go. Well, even if I could go in there, I can't go in at this time. So we'll have to wait and see. Dandelion. Um, we had our wedding photographer start a lot later because we wanted her to stay later, but yeah, dude, those days are early sometimes for weddings. Oh, I wonder if the leeks are over here. Let's go try to find those leeks. Or not the leeks, the spring onions. Let's see if they're around. We got a whole radish. Yes. Excuse me, what? What, is this one too good for my inventory? No. Oh, my God. <gasps> Hello. Oh, I wonder if I can activate the community. What do bubbles mean? Bubbles equal fish. Yes, exactly. Bubbles mean there's more fish and you can get them to bite a lot faster. How are you liking 1.6? I haven't. So I encountered a couple new things on my other farm, but so far this experience I feel like has been pretty much the same of starting a new farm. But I liked like the things like the bookseller I tested out. That was fun. Then I like the new pet additions. Let's see. Maybe I can trigger the community center cutscene. I don't know if it's too soon for that. I feel like it's got to be happening soon. So many leaks. Does she already marry Haley? Yeah. Um, no, I guess I'm not going to get it today. Damn. I like to visit once a week or so to catch up on things anyway. Oh, a little quest. I need a daffodil if it's not too inconvenient. I will do that, Alex. I have one right here, and I bet he's standing outside. Oh, he's not. But he's in here. He's not. Oh, he's freaking... Look at him working out. I wonder how long he works out for. Maybe I should just... Alex. <laughs> Alex. Alex. <laughs> Let's 
Don't mind me, Alex. I'm just having a snack. <laughs> Man. This is why I shouldn't eat on stream. I'm so bad. I'm such a mess. <laughs> such a better snacker than I am. I mean, the food I ordered is actually semi-healthy, but it's like a little carby. Like I had some, I ordered a, like a healthy version of some, like some chicken and rice and veggies. It's not the worst thing I could eat, but it's, I, I definitely snack on unhealthy things. Don't worry. Hello. I'm feeling pumped. You brought me the item I asked for. Thanks so much. Here's your payment as promised. Thank you. It's probably the fastest I've ever completed a little quest. Hello, George. I can't talk right now, miss. Well, you know what? I have a lot of leaks, and you love leaks. My favorite thing. Thank you. I love seeing George smile. It's worth it. Okay. What do I do now? Ah. Oh, this is... I knew this was going to happen. Sorry. Me too. Oh, my poor clothes. Dude, I spill on myself every day. I totally feel you. Hello, Penny. You're very lucky to have a library in such a small town. When you're lost in a book, it's easy to forget the reality. Oh, maybe that's why I like reading so much. Sorry, I got carried away there. Oh, poor Penny. I'm going to sit with you for a little bit. Why am I manspreading? She's sitting so cute and I'm just like manspreading. Oh, I did not like that. I don't sit, I don't sit like a girl. Poor Penny. He's so mean until he's not. Yeah, Alex, Alex seems like a douchey guy with like a sweetheart at his core. Oh, I keep forgetting I need to fix this. I need to do that. I gotta bring wood over here. Does doing quests for characters improve relationships with them? It does. It absolutely does. You get money and it improves the relationship. <sighs> okay, let's <clears throat> go home. Let's collect a little more wood along the way. Red Laven, thank you for the bits. Thanks for watching the stream. I wonder if the boulder will be removed tomorrow so I can go mining. Because that would be nice. Oh, this is a new addition too. This big ass fucking tree. And I don't know what it's about. Like, it's huge. They just, it's so big. And clearly, it, it's going to have, the, my, I have a little hand icon here. So something is going to happen here. And I don't know what. And I'm very excited about it. Fine, I'll install the game again. <laughs> Twist my arm, why don't you? <laughs> I totally understand, Bobby. <laughs> hi, Kel Kelis. I was going to say hi, Kelsey, but it's not your name. Kelis? Hello. Time to get home before the bats arrive. How much wood do I have? <gasps> I'm very close. Just need a little bit more. Eh, I'll just get it tomorrow. I'm kind of scared. <laughs> oh, I totally missed that while playing today. The big tree? Yeah, I noticed that like pretty quickly on the other farm. And I was like, what is that? That's going to be about something. I don't know what it's going to be about, but it's going to be about something. My parsnips! They're ready! Oh, 
I've got some new ideas to sleep on too. How exciting. The boulder's been moved. Our team members have removed the landslide caused by our drilling operation near the mountain lake. I'd like to remind you that our drilling operation is entirely legal. Pursuant to initiative L610091, Jojico Amendment. It's a <laughs> responsible stewardship of the local environment is our top priority. We apologize for any inconvenience this accident may have caused. As always, we value your continued support and patronage. Morris. Morris. That's not what I meant to do. Where is the little... Oh, because I haven't activated the community center yet. I'm nervous. I'm, I know I need parsnips for the community center, but I think I can sell these ones. So we'll sell, we'll sell these ones. And we'll put these ones away for now. Okay. Let's... I think maybe we'll trigger the community center scene now. Let's see. No. <sighs> oh, it's too early. It's really early. Oh, my God. I have no idea how early it was. It really should be... Oh, I should have brought the wood! The wood! Let me go get the wood. Yes, this is the game that has a museum that you gradually fill with things, Cal. That is correct. My God, Ridley is snoring beneath me. I wish you guys could hear him. <clears throat> I need like 80 more pieces of wood. fell in the water. Money, 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 money. Money. I can craft a scarecrow when I reach farming level one. I don't think I'm there yet. I think soon. It's 40. Oh my god, the sound just kind of came in there dramatically. Uh... So close. Just a little bit more. I got uh three hundred and four, we're good. Peak gaming athlete right here, I love it. <laughs> I'm just such a gamer. Crazy. Don't be intimidated, guys, okay? It seems a lot like Animal Crossing. Yeah, it's like a comfy, cozy farming game. It's the same kind of vibes. <gasps> We've done it. Community center cutscene. 
Oh, hi there. What an eyesore. Sorry for the chewing noises, guys. I'm trying to lean away from the microphone. This is the Pelican Town Community Center, or what's left of it anyway. It used to be the pride and joy of the town, always bustling with activity. Now, just look at it. It's shameful. These days, the young folk would rather sit in front of the TV than engage with the community. <laughs> <laughs> the, I don't I the only person that's watching TV is George. The rest of the people are out and about all the time, Lewis. I don't know what you're talking about. But listen to me, I sound like an old fool. Yeah, you do. You really do. Joja has been hounding me to sell them the land so they can turn it into a warehouse. Ooh. Pelican Town could use the money, but there's something stopping me from selling it. I guess the old timers like me get attached to relics of the past. Ah, well, if anyone else buys a JojaCo membership, I'm just going to go ahead and sell it. Oh, that's a thing. If you got, we could do the Joja route. We don't have to fix up the community center. We could just go simp for Morris. If you guys want to see that. If anyone else, I've never done that before. If anyone else buys a Joja Co. membership, I'm just going to go ahead and sell it. Sigh. Let's go inside. Oh, no. <laughs> What's this? I guess Vincent and Jazz must have been playing in here. This place is even more dilapidated than I remember. <laughs> what? What's the matter? Are you ill? <laughs> You saw something? Hmm. I wouldn't be surprised if this place was full of rats. <laughs> You're worrying me, Natalia. <laughs> Look, I think I'm going to head home. I need some lunch. <laughs> just, just like that. Enemy spawns! Kill them! <laughs> hey, I'll keep this place on lock from now on. Maybe you can help catch that rat if you have some extra time. Mm-hmm. It was a betrayal. It would be a betrayal, but I think it would kind of be funny to go simp for Morris. Although, I'd probably hate that decision after a while. I'll have to come back and explore this building further. Further as in right now. Right now. Go into this room. Oh, wait. Yeah. I have. Okay, so I have to try to read this, and I'm not going to be able to read it. And then that will trigger the wizard to send me a letter so I can meet the wizard. I'm off to see the wizard. Okay. Uh, let's see. What else do I need to do? I need... I was going to check about mining, but I have the wood on me. So let's go see if I can do the bridge. Is it anybody's birthday coming up? Lewis's birthday is coming up. But we have a bit. I've already looked in that trash can. I've already looked in the trash today. Okay. Hello, Lewis. Got to do the tree dance. Exactly. It's time for some psychedelics. <laughs> time for a trip. Oh, oh no. All right, I'll go fix the bridge and then I can pick that up. I can't wait to get the backpack. Oh my God. Gotta drink his forest soup, exactly. Yay! I like that you don't have to wait for this to be fixed overnight. It just gets fixed immediately. It's great.
hello. Fresh air of this valley is good for the body and the mind. A quick stroll outdoors always invigorates me. Okay. <laughs> Why do I get the feeling Nat has said that it's time for some psychedelics before? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, no. Can't pick up the sea urchin. It's fine. Well, I, could, I don't want to eat the horseradish. I need it. It's fine. We'll just get the... Sea urchin another time. It's Fabio! <laughs> it's pompous Fabio! Good morning, Bonjo! Coral are worth so much. It's great! Alright, this is kind of annoying, but I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna go get the sea urchin. I have to. I just have to. I like, I know it's there, and I need the money. Every penny counts! <laughs> the amount of times people in this town give you psychedelics is crazy. True. It's a very open-minded town. Well, some of the characters are, and Lua's not so much. Great. Just made a bunch of money. Uh, now, I guess let's see if the, let's, yeah, the mines should be open. It's a little late, but I can go get the sword. So let's just do that. Will you marry in this one? I don't, I mean, this is kind of like, I already have a second farm going, um, that I've been, or another farm going that I've been playing on more that I'm a little more focused on. So this is like a farm that I started with chat. So it's probably just going to be a farm that... I visit with you guys. So it depends on how far we get into it. I'm open to it, but it just depends on if we keep playing the game. Hello, Sebastian! <sighs> Whatever. <sighs> Fucking rude. All I said was hi. He goes, ugh, I don't really know you. Bitch. All right, let's go in here. <gasps> Time to meet this guy. Hmm. Marlon, that's his name. I always forget his name. Hello, I'm Brazilian, and I came to watch random Stardew Valley channels. Can I speak my normal language, or do I have to use a translator? Uh, I think on Twitch Nolt, I, I think the bot I have will... Yeah, we, we, we don't allow other languages here because I can't mod that, so... It's got to be English. I'm sorry. I know I don't speak Portuguese, so it would be impossible for me to mod. But thank you for asking. Welcome. Um, what? Yes, it's keep playing. Love you, chefs. Kisses from Brazil. Hi, Camilla. Uh, okay, you guys are just saying hi to each other. I was just trying to figure out the connections. You guys are cute. Okay, I was just peering down into this old mine shaft. It's been abandoned for decades. Still, there's probably good ore down there, but a dark place, undisturbed for so long. I'm afraid ore isn't the only thing you'll find. Just give me the sword. Thank you, Marlin. Finally! You received a rusty sword. You know what's kind of crazy? When you find a wooden blade, the wooden blade is better than the rusty sword. Just kind of crazy. My name's Marlin, by the way. I run the Adventurer's Guild right outside. I'll keep my eye on you. Prove yourself. And I think you might... I might think about making you a member. Should we go down? It's kind of late. But I kind of want to. I don't have much time. I'm not, I, I'm not going to reach level 5 today. This, I don't think that's going to happen. Oh, I got a geode! The first rock! Local blacks... 
can't speak. Local blacksmith can break this open for you. Who knows what might be hidden inside? Oh, that was fast. Oh. Oh, God. There's two! No! No! Oh. No! Oh. Oh god, oh god, I'm so bad at this. Oh, okay. Um, I have too many things on my person. Alright, yeah, this was this was dumb. I have too much stuff on me. Let's just go. It's a waste of time. I'll just come back when I have less things and then I can because I actually like I like hoarding materials. I want to collect them all. Trying to play Dragon's Dogma and watch Natty at the same time. Gotta admit, I'm not sure what Maggie is doing in this gameplay. What's Who's Maggie? <laughs> Are you liking Dragon's Dogma? I've seen some people play that. Short-lived. Yeah, I figured, you know, I'll just come back when I have... A little more space. Fucking loving it. It looks like fun. I'm probably going to go right to the mines tomorrow morning, so. Well, I'll keep the hoe. You got to keep the hoe. Always keep a hoe. Okay. Let's just go to bed. First step is admitting you have a problem. <laughs> have you ever played Minecraft? I have. It makes me way too nauseous, unfortunately. I got a scarecrow recipe. <laughs> I do have a problem with hoarding items. You're right. <laughs> I keep a roster of hoes. Always got to have a hoe. Let me just quickly check something. Okay. Um. I don't need to have the scythe on me today. Because I have the sword. We'll, we'll organize things in a minute. Wonder if maybe a different FOV could have helped. Eh, maybe. What the fuck? There we go. Maybe, but um, yes. Letter from the wizard. So something. My sources tell me you've been poking around inside the old community center. Why don't you pay me a visit? My chambers are west of the forest lake in the stone tower. Tower. I may have information concerning your rat problem. Hmm. <laughs> um. I tried like a really far out field of view. And it made the game hard to play. Like, it was really hard to click on things and be accurate with movement. And I was still getting nauseous. And then I tried third person, which third person Minecraft is just not the way the game is meant to be played. So it was horrible. Um, I'll probably go back to Elden Ring at some point, Skizane. I'm just, I needed a break. The game is a little stressful. All right. It's very early, so I can't really do anything except go to, the, I can go to the mines. Just go to the mines. Uh oh. I didn't want to pick up those seeds. I'm trying to avoid that. Okay. Get them later. The amount that I hoard in this game is out of hand. Dude, I want everything. I want to like pick up absolutely everything. It's hard. I'm definitely a hoarder in video games. Not in real life, but in video games, definitely. Okay. Oh. Here we go.
trying to get to level five. Ooh, an earth crystal. Ooh, copper ores. A magnet ring! Oh. oh, there's already a ladder exposed. Let's just do this, though. Whee! Oh. Hello. Inventory. Oh. oh no. Oh, let's just eat this. Oh, I forgot to put my watering can away. That would have helped. It's fine. Let's just, oh, let's collect these. Just a little tip, you can use the mouse wheel to change. Oh! Dude, thank you, Revenge. I never even bothered looking that up. Oh, wait a minute. I feel like this is a crab. No? Oh, my sword was just making a noise for no reason then. Oh, that's a crab! Come over here, you little bitch. Ah! There's another one. Come over here. You serious? Why are you being like that? Oh, I forget. I, I gotta keep using the scroll wheel. Goodness. Oh, he went quick. Okay. Let's see. It's always great fun watching you get jump scared. I do get irrationally scared. It's like not even a big deal, but I'm freaked out. Mines do scare me a little bit. I'm not super confident in the combat. See if I can reach level 10. I've got new ideas to sleep on again. Ooh, good luck day, huh? Um, let's eat a leek. <gasps> Amazing! This is amazing. God damn it. Die. Woohoo. Oh, do I want that geode? Um It's okay. I'll just leave it behind. Yay! Boots. 
this is okay we just drop we drop something on the floor and then we put the boots on there we go great try tapping it, it takes it's gonna take me too long to tap all the f things i'm i think scroll i just need to get in the habit of scrolling because i do think that that will help oh yeah i know checking i gotta check the journal i sometimes i forget oh i didn't realize i could break that All right, I do need to go meet the wizard. I don't know how late his tower is open. Oh, wait, you know what? This is probably one of those floors where the staircase is just way down here. So let's just go down here. Oh, God. A crab. Wow, I am just getting really... Lucky with the... <gasps> Come here. What is that thing on your head? What do you have to offer me? More boots? Plus one immunity. This is plus one immunity and one... So these kind of suck. Watch War of the Buttons? Is that a video? Oh! I didn't mean to do that. Oops. Ah! Nice! Okay, that's pretty good. Let's go. 415 is pretty good. Gotta go to the wizard's tower. You can hit the mine carts in the mine and they give you coal? I never knew this. That's crazy. God, I'm going to have to try that next time. I did not know that. Oh, God. Let's go this way. This is Stardew Valley, Kyosli. Ka oh, I don't have my axe. Whatever. Love the sound effects. Yeah, the sound effects are so good. Usually there's music too, which I could put on if you guys want. I usually just kind of play without the music. Or sometimes I'll have music on, but. We're off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz. Time for a trip. Ah, come in. Ooh. 
I'm Rasmodius, seeker of the arcane truths, mediary between physical and ethereal, master of the seven elementals, keeper of the sacred... Ch okay, you get the point. <laughs> and you, Natalia, the one whose arrival I have long foreseen. Here, I'd like to show you something. Behold! <laughs> You've seen one before, haven't you? They call themselves the Junimos. Mysterious spirits, these ones. For some reason, they refuse to speak with me. I'm not sure why they've moved into the community center, but you have no reason to fear them. I feel like my girl was barely phased by seeing that. <laughs> you found a golden scroll written with an unknown language. Most interesting. Stay here. I'm going to see for myself. I'll return shortly. <laughs> thank you so much for the bits. Uh, oh, no. Thank you for the gifted sub, JT King. I really appreciate it. And thank you for the super chat. Bob Bobbert. <laughs> I know you've reacted to the last time, but are you considering reacting to any other anime attack on Titan? My Hero Academia are super good. Thanks for the entertainment. Um, I avoid like true anime because Japan is crazy with copyright strikes. So most likely not. But thank you for the super chat. Imagine how long LinkedIn profiles would have been with all those titles. <laughs> true. I found the notes. The language is obscure, but I was able to decipher it. We, the Junimo, are happy to aid you. In return, we ask for gifts from the, val from the valley. If you are one with the forest, then you will see the true nature of this scroll. Oh boy, it's time for a drug trip. Y'all ready? One with the forest, what do they mean? Aha! Come here! <laughs> and drink my juice! <laughs> my cauldron is bubbling with the ingredients from the forest. Baby fern, moss scrub, caramel top toadstool. Can you smell it? Here, drink up! Let the essence of the forest permeate your body. He's so... Can you imagine, like, you just met this guy and he's trying to give you a potion coming out of a cauldron? I'd be like, no, I'm good. I've got to go. Wishing you all a nice weekend. Hope to see you soon. Have a nice one now. Have a good one, Orsha. Thanks for joining. Here we go. Oh, this is where the music would have been helpful. Okay, so I'll, I'll reenact what I think the music is supposed to sound like because I forgot I don't have the music on in my settings. Like, there you go. You're welcome. You've gained the power of forest magic. Now you can decipher the true meaning of the Junimo scrolls. Awesome. Uh, maybe I should put the music on <laughs> for you guys. Let the beat drop. <laughs> there you go. You're welcome. Ten out of ten soundtrack. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. I haven't heard the song in a while, so that's that's the best I could do. <laughs> She's been drinking the wizard juice juice for sure. Ah! Ah! Oh 
My God, what the fuck are you? What the? <laughs> I have never seen that before. Sorry for the scream, everybody. I wasn't prepared for that. Sorry. That's a friend. Oh yeah, it's a friend. That's a that's a, it's a it's a it's a ground it's just a ground friend. <clears throat> Why do they have to scare me like that? Welcome to the wilderness farm. It's a zombie cactus. Yeah, that is what it kind of seemed like. I was not a fan. All right. <gasps> I didn't mean to click that. I meant to click. Oh, wait. Yeah, I did. I meant to click queen of sauce. Great. I learned the stir fry. <clears throat> oh, Clint is going to teach me how to make a furnace. I'm gonna turn the music a little bit down. It's too loud. I had an extra set of blueprints lying around here. I want you to have them. You learned how to craft a furnace. Oh my god. Furnace allows you to use small bars. Bars can be used for crafting, construction, and tool upgrades. When you've smelted a few copper bars, consider having me upgrade one of your tools. It can make work a lot easier. Well, okay, I'm heading home. Take it easy. I just like it really quiet, okay? I see you've been exploring the old mine. You've got the adventurer spirit. That much I can tell. If you can slay ten slimes, you'll have earned your place in my adventurer's guild. Marlon, I'm pretty sure I've already slayed ten slimes, dude. Oh, wait, there's more mail. Robin here, I know there's a lot of stones scattered around your farm. If you have a surplus, you might consider... She always is advertising for this fucking well. I don't... A well is kind of useless to me right now. I don't... A well is like the least... The last thing I need. Oh, can I look at it yet? Oh, great. Okay, I have all of these things. So let's at least just go complete that bundle because then I can get, let's put this back. Um, all right. Let's just go do that. Need to go kill more slimes. Need to craft a furnace. Oh, I think I do have enough stuff to craft a furnace. I should probably... Let's just do that really quickly. Hold on. I went the wrong way anyway for the mines. Oh, no. I was going to the community center. Oh, my God. this The ADHD is starting to come to pl into play. <sighs> 20 copper or 25 stone. Holy smokes, I've watched you react to horror movies. You you mean like you didn't know it was me or like you like you just popped in and was like, "Oh, I've seen your videos." Or were you referencing my dramatic reaction to the monster earlier? <laughs> Either way, thanks for being here. Yes, exactly. Ah, well, welcome to the stream. Man, I need a backpack. 
First one is 2,000. Yeah. I, I can afford it now. I really should just go get it. I I was I kind of hoard my money for a little bit until I'm like, okay, I'm desperate. But I do hate having to manage inventory like this. Yee! Seeds. So we can go plant those today. There are monsters in Stardew Valley. Yeah. I'm, I'm living on a monster farm. So there's a lot of them. Got to get a parcel. I got to go get some seeds, too. That's the thing is I need... How long does it take to grow these things? Let's go see. Pierre's. Let's go to Pierre's. Oh, it's... Okay. Got to wait a minute. Oh! Penny, don't let her see. Ba -dum, ba -dum, bum, bum. This food is taking a while. I'm really hungry. Okay. Oh, I can go in now. Bum, bum. I like want the backpack, but I. 12 days. It's currently. Oh. Uh, we don't, oh man, I should have bought these seeds sooner. This is why I always get stuck not finishing the community center when I need to because I don't have enough days now to grow a cauliflower. Okay, let's just use all of my money. Let's do it. I want the backpack. There goes all my money. God of War 2018 is a death. Yeah, people have mentioned God of War to me. But I don't. I don't know. We'll see. It's. I'm open to it, but uh, not anytime soon, most likely. I mean, can you, is God of War PlayStation only though? I have not tried the metal farm at, the meadow, sorry. I almost said the metal farm. <laughs> and now I'm just imagining a farm where the music is hardcore metal screamo instead of, <laughs> instead of this peaceful, cute stuff that I'm listening to. Uh, I forgot what I was gonna say. This always happens to me. Check out Harvest Moon. I mean, I feel like everything I've heard is people said like Stardew was everything they wanted Harvest Moon to be. So I'm like, I don't I don't feel the need to play it, to be honest. Yeah, God of War is PlayStation exclusive. Yeah, then I'm less likely to play it, to be honest. Because I don't have a PlayStation and I don't really feel like getting one. Oh, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta expand. I gotta go wider here. This is, this is getting out of hand, okay? It's getting long. I, I don't like counting, so we're just gonna...
Oh, I should have done one more. Ah, crap. Whatever. I'm gonna undo that. I forgot I could just... Whatever. Uh, okay. Ah! The wrong button. You're missing out on amazing story skipping God of War. Yeah, but I just, I don't feel like getting a console and then hooking it up. Like, I have a Switch, I, I'll do that. But like, even that is kind of a headache. If they come to PC, sure, I'll, I'll check it out. But I don't want to buy a PlayStation just for one game. Like, it seems like kind of a waste. I'm not really a fan of the whole console exclusive stuff. You guys aren't going to convince me. I'm sorry. <laughs> if they ever... Uh, did I water already? No, these are new. Right, I need to... If it ever comes to PC, I'm open to it, but... That's a really... Uh, is PC also... Some people just said it was PlayStation exclusive. I'll look into it. It's okay. I I don't. It's okay, dopamine. I get it. There's so many like games that are exclusive, and then games that then aren't. Oh crap! That aren't exclusive anymore. So I understand. I would be. I would not be able to keep track of all that. Okay, let's. Oh god, I'm about to faint. I'm I'm so weak. Um I could go mm, There's no point in really doing this. Man, I'm so bummed about the cauliflower situation. Although Caroline might give me a cauliflower, maybe. I think she gives a cauliflower at some point. No, not this one. Wait. Oh, this is the fish. Oh. We have a shad. The chub is in a different room. Okay. I guess let's just go to sleep. It's only 25 bucks on Steam. Oh, okay. Well then, okay, there we go. It's back for consideration. I just noticed that the rug has monsters all over it. I was going off of somebody saying that it was PlayStation only, which to me, I'm like, that's a hard no. The pot Oh, I didn't need to buy a potato seed. That I already had a potato. I just didn't know what it was. I need more wood and I need to make another chest. But first, let's water the plants. Can you make something with all those veggies? I mean, you can learn to cook recipes, yeah. But in the house that I have now, there's no kitchen. So I'd have to upgrade my house before I can make anything. I actually don't understand how my grandpa lived here without a kitchen. It's kind of crazy.
Like, he was just living like a bachelor. With, like, a hot plate and nothing else. Oh, I do have my... want this to go into the water. Yay! There's a wonderful documentary on YouTube called Raising Kratos about the production for the game. It's an excellent watch. Right, I need to go back to the mines to kill slimes and get more ore. Oh, I need to craft a scarecrow. I can do that. <laughs> Grandpa was going to the saloon every night, yeah. Most likely. Okay, I think I have enough wood now to make a chest and a scarecrow, hopefully. Let's see. No, I don't. Oh my god, scarecrow takes up a lot of wood. I wanted to make another chest for community center stuff. He got drunk and played the arcade. Yeah, exactly. That's all he was doing. I'm about to pass out. Oh my god. I didn't notice until the bar started vibrating. My bad. Got a little carried away there. Hmm. I don't think I... Ha I need like two more wood, I think. Oh, no. You need like 50 wood for another... Okay, we're not going to worry about it then because I'm kind of low on energy. And I was going to go to the mines, but now I'm like... Don't have that much food well I could no I should sell this one hmm oh I can make another field snack All right, um, I guess we go to the mines. I feel, I feel a little scary doing that, but maybe I'll find more food along the way. Oh, you know what? Even though we have two backpack slots now, we don't need this, so let's just leave it. I would push the limit and catch one more fish and then faint. Yeah, I've pushed the limit before. But I just hate that it makes you tired the next day, too. Hello, sir. The crisp air of the wilderness is all I care to know. I live out here by choice. Well, that's great. Good for you. 
let's go look down here real quick. See if there's anything else. Also, these waterfalls are new in the game too, which is really cool. And I'm pretty sure even this bridge is new. I'm pretty sure it used to just be land and not a bridge. I don't know though. Okay. We should probably eat another one of these. Still a little low. Ooh! Ooh. Don't want to slice those bugarunos. Oh, God. Ah, shit. I always get so scared and swipe too early. Oh, no. There's more. Oh, God. I always, like, hold my breath when they're coming at me. No! Is it, like, a bad luck day or something? What? I didn't even check. Goodness gracious, leave me alone! Oh, God! It's treacherous down here. Rock lobster. Exactly. No, 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 no. Leave me alone. Cave carrot. Hey. I feel like what usually happens to me is like. I'll get so close to reaching another level in the mines and then I'll have no energy left and have to leave. I have not seen a single slime. Uh-oh. Not good. Let's just look around for a little bit. Oh, a slime! Cave carrot? Oh, I found seeds! Oh, three days for carrots. That's great. I likely, I, I'll play Red Dead again for sure, Alexander. I don't know when. I just really felt like playing this game today. I'm likely going to have to take next week off from streaming because I'll be traveling. Oh no, I have to leave. I don't have enough energy. So sad. So sad. Yeah, I can't do it. 
coal in the mine cart. Let's try it. You're right. I don't... I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, yeah, I don't I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Just wanted to pop in and say, hi, now isn't this a different energy to Elden Ring gameplay? It is, John. It truly is. Hello. Thank you for joining. Oh my god, I have to pee again. I'm so sorry, guys. Unfortunately, that is the life of someone on her period. Oh, a bat is coming! You bitch, I have a sword now! Oh, wow, the sword sucks. Jesus Christ. Um, I also plant the carrot seeds. I need to go to bed. I'm out of energy. Let's just do it another day. Not that mine cart. The one that's in the dungeon. The one that's in the dungeon. In the dungeon? I don't know if I know what you're talking about. <laughs> I'm sorry. Sorry, I didn't explain it. It's the one inside the mo- I don't even know if I- I'll have to take a look. I don't know what you're talking about. All right, I'm gonna go pee. Sorry. Sorry. Ugh.
Okie dokie. There was a Stardew update, Smokey. To anyone reading this, you should play Banisher's Ghosts of New Eden. I have never heard of that game, unknown. All right. It's a new day. My food is finally on the way. It took a really long time. It's I'm tracking it. So when it gets here, I'm probably going to log off because I don't really like eating on stream. But we have some time still. Oh, I need the watering can. Oh, my God. <laughs> let's let's chop more wood, too, to... Okay. Public mastication, like chewing? Oh my god. You really pulled that word out of a... <laughs> that's, that's a word of the day, huh? <laughs> you really pulled that out of your thesaurus. <laughs> Greetings from Belgian. Greetings, Dries, Dries? I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. When can you make sprinklers? I think, uh, yeah, I don't have the craft. I have to earn the crafting recipe first, and then I forget exactly what you need. Probably like a copper bar. Ooh, do I have enough core? Uh, well, can't speak. Copper ore. Yeah, I do. To make a bar. There we go. It'll work once I get it. Uh, I need to go. I got to go back to the mines. But let's go chop down some wood so I can make another chest. Yes. All right. Definitely have enough now. Yay. Okay, for the community center, I like to color them purple. I don't know why. Let's take this, let's take this, let's take this, let's take this. That's it for now. There's other, oh, the potato. Oh, I could go crack open the geode. I only have one, though. It seems kind of silly. should probably wait. I could get two more pine cone seeds. I could make even more field snacks. Okay, not a single one in there. That's great. <laughs> Good evening from my part of the world. Good evening. 
Uh, Smurf love is all. Smurfs, Smurfs. Smurf loves all. <laughs> Good evening. All right, I'm not a single pine cone seed. Wonderful. I don't know if I have enough energy to go to the mines, so I feel like maybe I'll just go around foraging more and see if I can get more food. Let's see. Hello, food. Oh, hello, Willy. Oh, six copper. I can bring him six copper ores, but do I have to collect them? Or can I just... I do. I'm supposed to collect them. That's so annoying. I hate that part. Whatever. I'm like, I already have them. Let's check the trash. Sometimes there's food in the trash. Oh, that was just trash. Wonderful. Oh, I forgot. If you right-click the tree first, you can shake it. And sometimes it'll drop seeds. That's a good idea, Torn. Thank you. I completely forgot about that. Rather than just wasting energy. What streamer is this? Uh, if you look at the, you know, the top or bottom, I don't, wherever you're watching, uh, there should be a little name with the channel. And it will tell you <laughs> what streamer this is. <laughs> Pine cone! Great. Bam, bam. Mm -hmm. Man, I am still so low energy to be going on into the mines. I really wish I had more food. I need berry season to happen or something. Okay. What website am I on? <laughs> Let's just look for slimes and see if we can like just do the, the least amount of... Okay, there's no, not a single slime on this floor. Oh no, I'm gonna sneeze. <coughs> Sorry, I tried to push the mic away so I wasn't yelling at you guys. Let's just go up here and see if I can find more slimes. Nope. Wow, there are none. Cause in height, thank you. All right, we yeah, we just have to mine, unfortunately. Oh my God. <laughs> Slimes. Oh, right, I forgot. I'm collecting copper. Oh my god, this game is not... This game, I get so distracted. 
Carrot seeds! Ugh. Dang. You... Stay away from me! Goodness. I- so- so hyped- Whoa! Sorry. Jesus. So hyped about the 1.6 update. So much new stuff to discover. I know. I'm like- I'm tempted to go on my, like, farm- where I'm at Ginger Island just to see if, like... If I can access more of the fun updates there. Like, for the further into the game, you know? Oh, good! More copper! Okay, I just need one more ore. Maybe let's just focus on that, I guess, right now. Oh my god. I don't have enough food for this. Oh god. Oh, okay. Well, there's that. Let me just quickly... Oh no! Never mind! Oh god, I panic so much. I don't know why. I just need to relax. Okay, we got the copper ores. I don't know why I get so scared out of nowhere for no reason. It's not my first playthrough, Michael. Oh, these mine carts, huh? <gasps> That's a lot of coal. Wow, I've never done that before. Slimes. Oh, these fucking things. Oh my god, there's so many of them! I've never seen that many of them. Oh, my sword sucks. Fuck. My sword is way too bad to deal with those things. Alright, I'm about to be out of food, so this is not... This is not good. Ooh, amethyst! You bitch! <laughs> God! My God. I can't. Because of the stupid worm thingies. Jesus, I hate that thing. I hate you! Fuck you! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm so angry! Jesus. Okay, let's get out of here. How many, well, how many slimes did I get? Mm. I still need, I'm only halfway. We're just gonna leave. It's fine. Let's just go talk to Clint. Got timed out on YouTube. Weird. I don't know. Maybe you said some. did you say something strange? Clint! <clears throat> oh, Clint! Oh, I'm gonna get cutscene! It's the Linus cutscene with the trash. He's so cute. Sounds like those raccoons are back, filthy varmints. Ah, you turned up at the right time, miss. Could you do an old man a favor? Could you go around the corner and scare off those raccoons for me? They've been causing a real mess. Thanks. Make sure you give them a good scare so they never come back. Oh, 
Poor Linus. It was me. I'm sorry. Oh. I find a lot of hot, fresh food in these cans. Stuff that will go to waste if I don't take it. Do you think there's something wrong with what I'm doing? Not at all, dude. You should get a job and stop leashing off others. Jesus. Uh, it's illegal. It's not illegal. Once you put something in a trash can, it's public property. Yes, it's disgusting. No, it's a shame for food to go to I, I always give the same answer every time. I've never given a different answer because I love Linus and I don't want to hurt his feelings. Thanks, Natalia. I knew you were an open-minded person. I feel good about what I'm doing. I'm not harming anyone. Grandpa's still alive. Yeah, Grandpa's... <laughs> that Grandpa's still alive. You can go on home. I promise I won't rummage in George's candy bar. Oh, dude, I do it every day. It's fine. You can tell him you scared off the raccoons for good. No! Wait. Oh, he's all nervous. Look at him trembling. I know what you were doing, Linus. If you need food, just ask. I don't want anyone in Pelican Town to go hungry. Here, I've got a basket of zucchini fritters for you. Just make sure you dip them in my spicy marinara. <laughs> I love Gus. He's like, I don't, I just want you to eat good food. I'm a cook. I don't care if you need food. I just want you to eat good food. There's really no harm in it. I mean, maybe the law is different in the States, but I know that when you throw something out in your trash can here, cops can legally go through it without a warrant. So. Ah! A possum! That's new. That's different. Oh, a dandelion. Hello. Sorry for all the screaming, guys. I get so taken aback sometimes by things. Gus is my spirit animal. I do love Gus. You motherfucker! He spawned the minute I walked onto my farm. That is so fucked up. That's crazy. Oh my god. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna deal with this later. I can't. It's dark. I'm gonna go to bed. It's fine. We're just going to bed. <sighs> in Germany, Germany trash is owned by the municipality so te I guess technically they're free to rummage through it as well yeah it's I mean if it's on your private property I understand like if somebody has to come on to your private property but if it's out on the street it's technically public property then I mean it depends on where you live I'm sure New crafting recipe, sturdy ring. I don't even know what the sturdy ring is for. Bug steak, that's good, because I need more food. Bum, bum, bum. Stir, oh, I've already learned that, okay. What are the fortunes telling me? They're pretty neutral, great. <gasps> it's time for doggo. Hello, Natalia. You see this dog here? I sure do. I love his little bandana. He's so cute. I found it sitting outside the entrance to your farm. I think it's a stray, poor thing. Hey, it seems to like this place. Don't you think this farm could use a good dog? Marty is out here trying to get me. I said out like a Canadian just there. She's out here trying to get me to adopt this dog when I'm broke as fuck. Like, I have no money. Luckily, dogs do not need food in this world. <gasps> Snooch is kind of a cute name. Should we just let it be Snooch? Or should I randomize it? I can randomize it and see what else comes up. We can keep Snooch in mind. Tulu? Sneckerdo? Sheckerdo? No. Cheapy? Witcha? Snippe? Tatsoni, Toulouse, Freckers, Shasso. You, you know what? Snooch is the best one I think we've seen. Snooch. 
Snoo for short. No, I think Snooch is kind of cute. Like, think makes me think of Hooch. Snoochie. <laughs> you be a good Snooch. Be a good pooch. Snooch the pooch. Oh, what a cute boy. What a sweet boy. The names. Wow. Yeah. Stardew Valley. The random name generator is kind of unhinged. More carrot seeds. Oh my gosh. Got a little close to the plant there. Uh, oh, I thought I had more seeds than I did. That's fine. Ugh. Always something to do. It rhymes, therefore it's a good name. I do gotta water his bowl now. I gotta keep that in mind. I wonder, because I know like the cats, when they fall in love with you, sometimes when you pet them, you get a fish. I wonder if that happens with a dog too, or if you get something else, or... Basically, all I've learned from Stardew Valley is that all forms of love are complete. Oh, there's already water in his bowl. Um, are completely transactional. It's all about what I can get from my from my love. It's completely conditional. <laughs> I don't know how many. I didn't even look. Do I need maybe just two or three? Oh, yeah. Just perfect. Great. Good evening, Grigsley. I hope you're doing well as well. Ooh, let's actually do... Let's go pop some geodes today. Why not? Let's live a little, you know? Ooh, I can make a bug steak, too. Food. <laughs> Pretty gross food, but food. Um, I should save. Let's just save both these daffodils. I'm gonna keep the dandelion for food. Why did why am I hoarding all these quartz? We don't we can sell some of them. Oh god, no, amethyst. I think we need to keep. Alright, let's do that. I don't know why I took so many. Okay. Uh All right, let's go to the blacksmith. I am doing really well today. Good. I'm glad to hear it. Enjoyed your reactions on some of the movies. Thought I'd follow you as you're pretty rad. You're pretty rad, dream, dreamer python. Your name is pretty rad. Thank you. Oh, Vin <gasps> it's Vincent's birthday. That's, I didn't mean to click that again. Uh, an invasive crab species is living in the local mine, threatening the native wildlife. <laughs> so, aka threatening the the bats and slimes and other monsters that live in the mines. These creatures are known for disguising themselves as stones. I'll pay someone to slay five of them. I mean, I'll accept the quest, but I'm probably not going to do it. It's probably how it's going to go, if I'm being honest. We got to go home and get that daffodil for Vincent. 
because it's his birthday. I miss Lewis's birthday, but really, who gives a fuck? Honestly, it's Lewis. I always miss his birthday. I don't think I've ever remembered his birthday. I managed to get two women's phone numbers in the last few days. Congratulations! I hope that one of them is a keeper. Poor Lewis. <laughs> he's fine. I just, you know, he's, he's not that bad. He's not as annoying as Clint, but... I do forget his birthday all the time. I never remember it. But Vincent, I pretty much always remembered. Can't we keep it? I mean, you can keep both, but not forever. I don't think they would like that. <laughs> Everybody halt! Where is your son? <laughs> Where is your son? Okay. It's fine, we'll leave. It's probably at the museum, actually. Let's go to the museum. Well, let's go to the blacksmith first. So we're gonna crack open these geodes and then we'll pop by the museum. We'll give your invincible reaction a shot later. Thumbnail looks appropriate. It, <laughs> I would say it is, <laughs> it's pretty appropriate. Thank you. Thank you for for checking it out. All right, let's go. Uh, yeah. No, crap. Ah, there we go. Ooh. Mm. Ah, okay. I think I can donate two of those things. Yep. That's good. 10 coal isn't so bad. I do need coal. Abysmal. Not a single piece in the entire collection. I have so many random hatreds for some of the townsfolk. Yeah. Everybody has their biases, Sunflower. What's this? You found something? Let me see it. Remarkable. It's very old. I'd love to study this in greater detail, but it is yours. Hmm. I've got a favor to ask you. Would you consider donating any new artifacts or minerals that you find? We can make a groundbreaking discovery together. Oh, and who knows? If you keep donating, I might come across some interesting items to send your way. You know what's interesting? This guy never leaves the museum. Like, you never see him out and about. He doesn't go to the festivals in town. Like, all of the other people, like Willie and Marlin and, like, the people who work at the establishments go to the festivals. This guy never goes anywhere. He just lives in the museum. <laughs> if you decide to donate, just bring the objects to the front desk. He is the museum. <laughs> yeah, he's like a ghost. <laughs> Pam is pretty bad, you're right. Okay, let's donate. Whee! It doesn't seem like you have anything. Okay, all right. Time to give Vincent his birthday gift. Is that a birthday present? Can I open it now? <laughs> oh, wow. This is exactly what I wanted. Yay, 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 yay. <laughs> oh, I love him. He's so cute. Don't tell anyone, but I snuck into the old community center last night. I think it's haunted. Uh, girl? Good for you. Whatever. I don't care. We don't have a school here, but I'm doing my best to give Vincent and Jazz a proper education. Penny, you're so precious. Every child deserves a chance to be successful. You're, you're right. Um... I don't know if you're qualified to be teaching them, but good for you. Oh, I got to forgot to talk to Clint. I have to go talk to Clint. What do you think Gunther would sound like? Well, based on the music, I think he kind of have a southern drawl, like a almost like a Georgia kind of accent, like, "Oh, this collection is abysmal. I can't believe it." But only because he's got that like kind of western hat and the country music in the in the museum. You brought the ores I requested. Excellent. I like to inspect local ores from time to time to keep track of quality and abundance. Let me just take a look at these. Hmm, I see. Thank you. You can keep these ores. They're of decent quality. And here's your payment, as promised. Money, 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 money. It's the only reason I do this. Is for money. And improvements in my relationships with the townsfolk. 
All right, let's. Uh, we could go to the mines. I don't have much food again, but you know, can try to go get some rock crabs or slimes or something. Sure, he could be Jamaican as well. Honestly, why not? With a name like Gunther, it'd be surprising, but anything's possible. <gasps> My food is about to be delivered. Okay, we're just gonna finish out this day and then I'm gonna head out. I don't know you well enough to trust you, sorry. Okay. I understand, Linus. I mean, we did have a bonding moment last night where I told you I don't really mind if you root through the trash. I thought we had made some progress, but you know, it's, it's fine. Okay, rock crabs. Finding rock crabs is, ow, you little bitch. I hate you. Oh, I. God, this sword fucking sucks. <laughs> oh God. I'm probably going to abandon Demetrius's mission, to be honest. I, hunting for rock crabs actually sounds horrible. Linus is a senior WFA software... Software develop, everyone's afraid to fire because he wrote the... Uh, I'm not sure I get the joke. It's a little niche for me. <laughs> what floor am I even on? I don't even know. Probably five. You stupid little worm. making progress on this only two more yeah I'm gonna I'm just gonna delete this now I don't even want to worry about it to be honest rock crabs are always around until a quest needs them true how funny would it be if I just start to find a million now that I've canceled the quest that would be so funny that's how it always goes I just don't even want to Ooh, Ruby Okay, let's let's go to a different. I gotta try to find a staircase. Oh no, we get out of here. No, thank you. No, thank you. Well, all I have left is a little algae, so pray for me. I really would like to find two slimes. Oh, hello. Oh crap. Great! One slime. Oh, you son of a bitch! I can't believe it. It's fine. It's only one out of five that I would have needed. <laughs> Let's go back here. Come on, I just need one more slime, please. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Come here. Yay! Enter the Adventures Guild. Let's go. Nah, there's a quest for those rock crabs. Yeah, thanks. Thanks. Thanks, Gither. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. It's so... Oh, my God. The dopamine that hits when I hear that, like, quest accomplishment sound. It's great. 
Oh, I, oh, you know what? It's fucking worth it. I'm buying this. I need a better sword. I can't stand this piece of shit. Goodbye. 20 out of 1,000 slimes, 1 out of 200 bats, 16 out of 80 cave insects, 2 out of 30 duggies, 4 out of 60 rock crabs, but yet none of these describe the horrifying things that come out of the ground on my farm. That's fun. Come back when you're done to show me, kid. I knew he was going to say that. All right. Let's go home because I'm hungry in real life and I think my food is here. They're called vegetables, <laughs> right? They're not even really monsters. They're just, they just want to hug. Ooh, food. Great. I really shouldn't have given my horseradishes away to Leah. I kind of need them. I had Pauline Gee's pizza for dinner. Who is Pauline Gee? I hope the pizza was good. Plants have feelings too, you know. Mm, you know, that applies, but if we're watching Little Shop of Horrors, I don't really care about the plant's feelings. I'm not going to lie. We can sell one of those. Or no. Well, yeah, we'll sell one. It's fine. I'll keep the ruby for now just because I like to hoard things. Oh, I got to give those to Gunther. Oh, okay. I got to give them to Gunther. Okay. All right. Well, this is a pretty productive uh, beginning to a new farm. I'll probably, what I'll do, guys. Hey, Taco! Uh, I'll probably, what I'll do is use this game as like, Audrey just wants to feel, to not feel empty is all. Uh-huh. <laughs> Batman. Who is the streamer? What is this game? What platform is this? All the questions. That's funny. Oh my God, that cracked me up. Um, what I'll probably do is use this game as just like a thing to unwind from other streams with that are more eventful or like if I just want to get on and play Stardew for a little bit um, at the end of a work day, but I don't really feel like being super high energy with the stream. That's what I'll probably save this kind of game for because that's what it's kind of perfect for. Um, I probably won't be able to stream next week, sadly, because... I'm traveling most of next week, so it's just kind of impossible. For I'm, I'm not going to have time to stream or even bring a setup with me. But, uh, sorry, I got distracted. But um, I will play again soon, probably the week after. Um, prob I don't know if, about this, but we'll definitely get back into some more energetic streams after. I'm really excited. So thanks for joining. Thanks for hanging out with me, y'all. I really appreciate it. Um, let me quickly see. My goodness. Ah, always struggle with this. Let me quickly see. I don't know if there's anybody live that I really would raid. Nah, everyone, it's fine. We, we won't raid anybody today. Thanks for hanging out with me. Have a good rest of your weekend. Uh, I'll see y'all later. Take care. Bye.